Oh shit. Well, what, what do I do with the shackle? I have shackle. I have shackle and boss. How do I do this? Do I wait? Do I run early? No, you leave! Fucking no! <laughs> I didn't know the order! <laughs> no! I didn't know the order! I'm so wait, wait, no, no, I have it. Don't draw. I'm gonna put the, the bounce pad on this side of the ladder. That's and then idea. you land on that. That's a good idea. I was trying to, then... I was trying to think. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, you're good. So it's like right in front of the ladder? Yep. I don't know. Maybe he's not here. Maybe this is just yeah, like the setup. Oh, yeah, he's, I think God. he's down here. I, <laughs> I think he might be down here. Um, no. Build a frame for a transportation portal, fabricating a gateway connecting two points in space. A pool of scrying magic through which you can observe actions lands away. A staircase carved of the finest marble of in Pe impeccable craftsmanship and exquisite quality. An infinite nexus of all possible realities through which any human can step to travel anywhere their heart desires. Lander. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't understand Oubliette Lander. <laughs> Phase two, please. A fish. I fear not your bucket. I'm here to tell you, I have zero respect for whatever is in that bucket. None whatsoever. Absolutely no respect. Oh. Go fish? No, you. <laughs> Yeti, ah, oh. nice boss. Power. Because the idea seemed to be it bites you and then flings you in a fucking. Ah, oh, there's. Okay, are you the first one? Um. What? <laughs> Fuck off. Prawn suit! <laughs> it's so done with my shit right now. Alright. What's happening? It's so large. He's a large. Glad to sign it. No, he's so noodly! <laughs> As I suspected, the etheric disturbance here is no natural occurrence. Is he coming? It does oh, he was Maybe way was further away than I thought. Wow, he was a lot further away than I thought he was. He's, he's still coming. He's. 
He's still coming. Damn, that is... That is a deceptive gauge of distance. I guess he's just... He must have been... Really, really large. I thought he was a lot closer. Anyway, I'm gonna go... Are you hungry? I'm gonna go get some... Some snacks. What the <laughs> Squares, I have a few questions. And gently, I can do to go back isn't the same one as a starter for bread machine cannon. <laughs> What the fuck is the bread machine game? <laughs> Plumbers and the predators remain on their specific list of votes. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. He's going for the two major voting blocks of his constituents, the plumbers and the predators. <laughs> Welcome, Squidling, to the Squiddy Pool. We gotta take a break. Oh my god. God, there's so uh, much shit on the ground, including explosives. Is it to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Yes. <laughs> well, there you have it, lad. <laughs> Moral dilemmas with Kratos. God of war and also parenting. It, like, he's the last... It's gotta be the last boss, right? There's surely a phase two. Yes, keep playing metal music. He's edible. <laughs> Keep charging! Keep charging! Keep charging! Keep charging that shit! I feel guilty. I fuck him up! <laughs> Keep charging! Keep charging! Oh, we're getting so many achievements for like Keep doing fucking this. charging that shit! And we won! Okay, we're good. Uh, it's me, the ankle bandit. Oh, I didn't get his face based to back up. I mean, no! Oh! I just fucking baseball batted him back up! That motherfucker wound it up! I just went. All right. Come on down, chief. See what happens. Bam! <laughs> oh, no, he knows the mechanic. No. I like him. <laughs> I'll never forget you. <laughs> Arkin. Are you okay? Are you alright? I don't like Sudoku! <laughs> oh Fuck no. It. Love me. We're doing it. Yeah. Oh, we're, is it supposed to be this? Love me, brother. <laughs> I, I'll, I'll never forget you. I was trying to take you with me, you son of a bitch! <laughs> Fight. That's this is the lowest energy fight ever. <laughs> it's like two incredibly overweight geriatric old men having a disagreement. <laughs> battle for sure <laughs> holy fuck oh i love rats <laughs> they're so funny down there is more down this is not the same one you can tell on account of there's an explosive 
It's a different wreck, Captain. It's another one. Ooh. What the fuck just happened? <laughs> oh my god. Whoa. <laughs> I found, so, so I found a powder keg. Um, I shot my harpoon at Squiddish at your name tag because it said that you had treasure. And I was like, oh, I'll harpoon him. I'll be useful. I'll the neurons in my head think I was just going to blast the fucking door. Oh, my God. All right. Good work, gun. Imagine gravity is fractal. Because light is just a wave, and gravity is just a wave. So imagine there's a big piece of glass that splits up gravity like a prism, so that there's, like, blue gravity and yellow gravity, <laughs> and then somebody gets hit by the red gravity, and it makes them super heavy, so they have super strength, okay. but, like, they're also really slow. And another guy gets hit by microwave gravity, so he's trying to zap everybody, and just when he's about to zap the main guy, we see a lady come out. And she turns out to be ultraviolet girl. And she has super speed, so she beats him. This and is it, just... like, also gave her giant cans. Zombie... <laughs> Thomas Pinchon, Gravity's Rainbow. Okay. From Caleb. Oh, hey there. This is a weird fucking bit, isn't it? You want to watch a fully grown adult human get lost and then stuck on an incredibly simple puzzle for like four hours? Stick around. me I'm live for my daily 40 minutes before i just fuck off into the ether <laughs> which is what's happening for some reason director scar link 1429 trench to stimria sock unctina blackjack cooper uncertain ac the rock devil urela paladin janey hexy woo starting us off with a cannonade welcome in everybody more than 24 hours of dd2 um Uh, who wants to tell him? Who wants to tell him? That we are, that's, that, that we're not that thing. That's... <laughs> I'm sorry. We're, yeah, we're getting closer. It's, it'll be like, is this a Japanese release? It'll be like tomorrow night. We're like 36 hours from Dragon's Dogma 2. We're getting there. We're definitely inching ever closer. Welcome in, everybody. Never heard of this game before Squid mentioned it yesterday. Balatro? It's the kind of game that immediately popped off with exactly the sort of people that you would imagine that it would. And then nobody outside that sphere, I'm sure, has ever seen it. It's, I mean, it's a roguelike. It's a roguelike deck builder. You watch people that play roguelike deck builders? You've 100% seen Balatro by this point. If you don't, you probably haven't. There is absolutely zero overlap. It is the purest roguelike deck builder. It is a roguelike traditional deck poker based roguelike deck builder. So it's just, it's literally fucking poker. And, and I need something to do for a couple of days. I might literally, this, this may just be a single stream game because I, by the way, I forgot to mention this yesterday. We have officially we have officially the date for Strange Aeons Chapter 3, if you did not see that. And it is this Saturday. My stress levels 
are absolutely planetary at this point because I'm not, I don't know. I don't feel ready. But there's the announcement. There's the trailer. This Saturday, three days from now, Strange Aeons Chapter 3 starts. In related news, not that I've really streamed much in the last week or two anyway, but I don't know that I'm going to stream tomorrow because I definitely want to play Dragon's Dogma on Friday. And I may need like one more panic setup day <laughs> to just... I'm sure I could literally drive over to the studio right the fuck now and run the premiere for Chapter 3 and be fine. But... You know how I am. <laughs> you know how I fucking am. <laughs> and I'm stressed. And I need more prep. I need more just in case. I need more readiness. There's an interesting challenge in the beginning of this chapter for me specifically. It's an inter interesting challenge from the angle of running this as a show. And that's making it interesting of two options hand wave a large chunk of this or figure out how to make it interesting because this book is fucking insane this is the craziest chapter yet but we got to get there the there's a little bit of a bridge from where we are to the absolutely fucking insane shit there's a little bit of a fucking bridge i need to cross the bridge i need to be on the other side of the bridge and that bridge i gotta figure out still well i mean i, I know i've mostly have it figured out but you know stress stress and over preparation and more stress anyway Bolitro. i haven't opened this game yet so here is the usual caveat of i don't know how loud this is going to be I don't know. I know we we kind of have moved on from that era. Welcome, Emery Memento. We've sort of moved on from the first time launch of a game. Absolutely just obliterating your eardrums. I think we left that one back in like 2020. Which I just got not quite Steve Irwin, but something akin to it by I I meant I, I wanted to say a year that was like five years ago. And my brain said, like, 2010, 20, 2012. No, 2020. 2020 is pretty close to five years ago. That's, that's where we're at. I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened to all the intervening time. I do. It was COVID. COVID happened all the intervening time. But just in case, here's your warning. We're past the era. We're past the era of the eardrum destroyers. I appreciate being past the era of the eardrum destroyers. It was not a fun time. I'm glad games launched at a reasonable fucking volume now. So for those of you who have not seen this, roguelike poker deck builder. That's it. That's all it is. No, I do not know what the name is. I don't know what Balatro is. I don't know what it's a reference to. I have no fucking idea. Devs came up on blowing people's eardrums out when Elden Ring proved you can force people to use PPE for a game startup with nothing but light and no sound. I forgot. I forgot about the literal flashbang that is opening Elden Ring. You actually just burn out your fucking redness. So I've seen a bit of this. This is not the blindest play. This is... It can jiggles. It wiggles. This is not the blindest playthrough I've ever done. That said, I don't really know how much you could know about this game that would help you anyway. I, I've seen a bit of it. Because, you know, it's not exactly news. I watched me some Northern Lion, and Northern Lion is currently absolutely and completely fucking addicted to this shit. 
not that I've really watched. Watched is not the correct word. That man is a background noise engine for me. And he's a fantastic, especially when he's when he's playing games I don't understand, like this. It's just background noise while I'm like making dinner or whatever. So I have heard the laments. I know the gen I, I get the concept. And that's about as far as it goes. Only the base concept. Let's just let's just do it. Let's just hit the game. Apparently we have a guide. We'll be guided by Jimbo the Joker card. Alright, teach me how to play. Get chips. Defeat blind. Very poker themed. This is a small blind. You need 300 chips to beat it. Select a small blind. You're playing poker, so chips come from doing poker stuff. You get a base amount of chips and then some multiplier. Blue is chip value, red is multiplier. It shows you poker hands and shit. Oh yeah, here we go. Here's all of our base values for everything. But they apparently have levels. Fair enough. It's kind of crazy. I need 300 to straight. It's only worth like 120. That's, that's kind of wacky, honestly. That seems like it's a very large number. But I imagine we'll find out very quickly it's not that hard of a number. We'll see. It seems like a big number just fucking looking at this. Oh, the cards also have chip values based on their rank. Okay, that makes sense. Fair enough. Okay, okie dokie. Flip the five cards and press play hand. I don't wanna. I don't have shit. <laughs> like, I have a pair. That's all I have. And if, if I play the pair, I lose this but the fucking straight I almost have. I don't want to play the shitty pair. I guess I'll play the shitty pair. So is it... So that's a pair. But if they're all chips, would it still be better to just dump everything? Like, is it better to just play literally whatever for the... Or does it only count the cards that are in the pair? It only counts the value of the cards that are actually in the pair. Okay. You can discard up to five selected cards to make even stronger hands. Try it. What do I want to yeet? I don't know. What are we shooting for? What are we What are we close to? We're one off a of spade flush. Spade flush would probably be nice. Flush has got to be decent, right? Flush is above straight? Really? Look, I'm not obviously not a big poker person, but it seems like it's way easier to make a flush than it is to make a straight. Am I wrong? I mean, clearly I am because like this is poker works like this for a reason, but it seems like it's going to, well, I guess in this scenario where I have like a huge hand and I can discard to fish for specific things, then yeah, it's obviously way easier to do here than it would be in any other traditional fucking poker thing. I just want to toss these. I toss this bitch too. She's not really doing anything. I mean, the odds of us pulling a nine and a ten are basically fucking zero. I don't want to throw away this pair in case I have nothing else. I got a spade. I got a spade. Okay, you only have a limited number of hands and discards per round. It's currently three. Oh, you get to play a bunch of hands. Okay. Earn 300 chips for you. Run out of hands to win the round. Okay. Okay, we'll tell you what you're doing, so you don't have to, like... You don't have to trust yourself to not be stupid. It will tell you the thing that you're playing. All right, that's good. Go, my child. I did it. <laughs> Flushed successfully. Okay. All right, and then you get... Three dollars for winning, and then your remaining hands also give you more money. Okay, so you want to make the hand- you do want to make the hands as huge as possible, because you get extra money for having leftover hands. Okay, now that I have cash, I can buy cards in the shop. Now we're getting into the deck builder part of this, because it is a deck builder. 
Try buying this plus four molt. Okay. This is one of the 150 jokers. Every joker does something different. This one just gives plus four multiplier to everything that you play. That does seem pretty fucking good. You can only carry five joker cards at a time. By the other cards in the shop, the Empress enhances two selected cards to molt cards. I don't know what the fuck that means. What does that mean? Is tarot cards a consumable? It will enhance your playing cards. Hold on to it. You can carry the two consumable cards with you at a time. You save up enough, you can buy a voucher. Oh, and vouchers passively give you upgrades. Okay, so vouchers seem like they'd be huge. I mean, passive upgrades are good. Restocked after you defeat the boss blind. And there's booster packs. Because <laughs> it's a fucking deck builder. So we can get some booster packs. You can add cards into your deck. So you can have duplicates of certain cards. So you can actually like build around different things. So I've seen this. You can get to a point where you have 15 fucking aces of spades in your deck. And all you do is play four of a kind ace of spades over and over again. Because the half of your fucking deck is ace of spades. This is, this is going to get wacky how do i have four dollars didn't i just get five dollars and then spend five dollars okay selecting the big blind will earn some cash or you can skip it and get a tag each tag has a unique effect even on the boss blind it has an ability with the player on discard two random ah so you can't like you can't safely save cards to try to build towards like a flush or a straight because you're gonna eat everything you beat the ante goes up and all the blinds become harder beat ante eight to win okay what is this there's one dollar per unused discard this run like immediately or is that ongoing because that just seems worse than four plus dollars for three dollars i'd rather get four plus dollars does that go forward in perpetuity like do what does every time that i finish with leftover discards i get more money because that makes it seem okay it could be decent and it seems like it pay for itself pretty well i don't know i want to play oh i need to play some of this so let me just go play this you get more cards, remember you can rearrange them. Jokers trigger in order from left to right. Make sure you use your consumables. Use them. Don't fucking hoard them forever. Use that shit. Okay. It's like the two cards. All right, what? Oh, plus four more. Oh, it just makes the card more valuable. Ooh. The big ones. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, they're scribbly now. Okay, well, on the one hand, I can just eat a two pair at this. What's a two pair worth? I feel like this is gonna win immediately. Yes. Yes, it is. All right, fair enough. Thank you for my $7. I appreciate you. The congregation you was win. <laughs> like, okay. Now we're, okay, now it's gaming. Now it's just gaming time. I permanently gain plus one hand per round. This refreshes after the boss. The boss is the next one. So I either buy this now or I lose it. Um, converts up to three selected cards to hearts. <laughs> okay. We can start really just fishing for one suit. All right. Level up two pair. Jesus, I don't fucking know. What this, I don't know. I feel like I should buy the voucher. Need to play an extra hand. Hand seems like it's huge because not only does that help us not die, hands also convert to money. 
so like in the long run this will eventually pay for itself assuming we get to a long run we probably won't get to a long run this is the first go and i don't know what i'm doing all right you six hundred dollars and we can't Ooh, this sucks we can't really fish because it's gonna discard random shit per hand played okay no we can fish it's per hand played so i could like do we go for a flush or a straight i'm close to both i think i'm closer to a flush i don't want to toss this dude because this dude uh, i would like to get him in a hand but realistically i don't know that that's gonna happen I think I toss all of these and I hope that of the three cards we draw literally one of them is a heart and then this guy's gonna get Jotun well if this is gonna get Jotun anyway I might as well discard a hard mill for the hearts I guess don't get greedy did not draw one heart that's unfortunate oh yeah we did I'm stupid I was looking at these three. We, we we did a fourth one. Okay, and then I just play this, and then this shit's all going in the trash. Okay. Guess that's about as good as it's gonna get. Go, my children. Kept the big one. That's cool. Then you molt me. Okay, 600 is a dramatically easier target than I thought it was gonna be. This is... It's much easier than I thought. <laughs> It's not actually a big deal. Um, what the fuck? This sucks. This is ass. This is like booty butt cheeks. What do you work? 11 chips? I'm not fucking close to anything. I'm keeping you because at least you're a fucking pair. Turns out starting with plus four molt every hand's pretty powerful. Yeah, it's pretty good, it turns out. It's, it's pretty all right. We already know... Hey, look at this. There's only one Jack left in the deck. He's a big boy, though. It's fat money if I pull him. Let's do that. Fuka. Another flush. We're shooting for another flush. Give me the diamonds, Chief. Thanks. Well, flushes are us. Wait a minute, is that card counting? <laughs> yeah, it's the card counting mechanic where you click on your deck and it counts all your cards for you. Okay, yeah, 600 days. This is, in fact, the first round. It's not that hard. Now we got $5. We got three additional dollars. With one extra dollar from the voucher. We get an extra dollar for the voucher every time. Unless we use all our hands, in which case the voucher has stopped us from losing. So, you know, it's pretty good regardless. All right, what's this? Permanently gain plus one discard per round. That's not as good as the other one. Plus one molt per consecutive hand played without score, without a scoring face card. Each played card with diamond suit was 1.5 molten scored suit changes at the end of the round. Times 1.5 mold. Wow, okay. So that really wants me to not do flushes. <laughs> so it's gonna want, want me to include a variety of cards. Times... These trigger before... These trigger before jokers, though. Hold on one second. I have a phone call. I do actually have to take this. Sorry. All right. I'm sorry. Give me a sec.
Welcome, Squidling, to the Squiddy Pool. Chat, don't tell the streamer I'm here. Shh. Hi. It's me, I'm back. All right. Ooh. Sorry. I hope chair kept you entertained for some time. Ponticon, 89 months in the pool. You're with the shiniest squidling. Sorry, that was a that was a super that was a call about a job interview. I need that one. That's important. I'm, I'm kind of in the market for those right now. Those are, those are valuable. So I had a thought, by the way, related to that. That uh, I'm gonna turn this game down a little bit. It's a little, perhaps a wee little bit loud. When. I talked about this before the fact that I was looking for another job and then when I found one I was probably just you know by necessity of the amount of time I'm gonna have in my day going to stop streaming largely occurrence the problem I have in the streaming career path is you know income And the problem I would have keeping doing streaming if I got a full-time job was time. But if you look outside of, you know, like Arby's and fucking Kmart, there are like legitimate, like city government part-time jobs that pay pretty decently well and are, well, part-time jobs that I could still stream around decently well. And then from there, I could figure out what I want to do. So, I can't say what's going to happen yet. But if I find a decent, I don't know who has decent part time jobs outside of like the government, but if I can find a decent part time job, I will be streaming less, but I'm not going to have to throw in the fucking towel on this shit forever. That's, uh, that's what that interview call was for is for a pretty solid part-time job. If this, if that goes well, then I don't have to stop streaming. I can just do both. Pharmacy is also a good idea. I didn't think about that one. Okay, I want this guy. He seems cool. So I want him. It said they go, Joker's go left to right. I don't know when this triggers. I don't know if this triggers when the diamond is scored. Or when he goes off. He said Joker's trigger in order, so I'm gonna assume that he'll just like count them all and then go nuts at the end. I want him to be at the end because it's a multiplier to my multiplier. So I want this dude to go first. Okay, let go. Things and options ought to be suggested. Uh, yeah, sure, I don't care. Also, I want to go into settings. Audio. Shoutouts this game launching at 50. I'm gonna ask you for like a 30 maybe. Thank you. High contrast cards. What does that what does that do? Ah. It makes blue and yellow cards. I see, fair enough. Now all the cards get to be their own colors. That does make it much easier to immediately delineate between like hearts and diamonds and spades and spades and clubs in particular. I've always had a hard time, like, at a quick glance, telling spades and clubs apart, because these shapes aren't even very different. Hearts and diamonds isn't as bad, but clubs and spades are real fucking similar shapes. Oh, fuck, that flush bills did that. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll definitely hit that. I'll hit that one for sure. Okay. Upgrade three of a kind by three levels. I don't know what that does, and I've never played a three of a kind before. <laughs> I just sort of want to see what levels do. I'm skipping this. Okay. So it just in increases both numbers. It increases both numbers by a fucking large amount. This is almost straight flush levels of value now. 
How is three of a kind below straight and flush? That's crazy. Okay, so we really want to just... I don't know how to... I don't know what kind of, like, drafting options we have. We really want to try to get to a point where I just have... As many copies of as few ranks of cards as possible. <laughs> I feel like I need to fight this for some money so I can go to the store. I don't know what tarot cards do, though. The tarot cards could be really good. Yeah, fuck it. I just want to see shit. If I die, I die. I want to see stuff. Give me, show me more tarot cards. I want to see what the options are. Hey, look, a three of a kind. Doubles money. No. Enhances one card into a stone card. Plus 50 chips, no rank or suit. Hmm. Increases rank of the two selected cards by one. That's good, because inc increasing rank will make them duplicates of other cards. So, like, am I correct in assuming if I increase the rank of a 10, it becomes a jack? I'm assuming that's how that works. Because that would give me a fifth jack. And then I could just put it on the seven, and that would be a fifth eight. Actually, well, I'll find out in like five seconds, because I'm almost definitely going to pick that. It's about two random planet cards. Okay, give me strength for sure. Buff these. 10 and 7. Jack and 8. Yep, okay. So that narrows us down. So that, that thins our deck a little bit, makes it more likely we'll get duplicates. Or shots of three of a kind. Thirty extra chip. I mean, I guess we could just buff these other two jacks. We could just bump we could just be the Jackie boys. Like Planet was the planet card's the thing that buffs hands, right? Could have had six queens. Could have had six queens. But I, I don't want to lose... I don't know if I would have lost the multi, I guess. I, don't, I didn't want to lose the multiplier thing by getting rid of these. I don't know if that would have been better to have six queens or to keep the plus four multipliers because we're kind of going to Jackistan right now. Okay, <laughs> we're just... Welcome we're fucking... Sweetie. We're going to Jackistan. Like this. <laughs> Now I'm gonna draw none of them. Vault, I see it. 59 Adore. months. Just a little further. Fucking now. stop. You were the shiniest squid link, but stop. Do not use the door. Remain in the penthouse. Thank you for your support. This is the, it's the first couple runs of a new roguelike. It's the science time. We're probably gonna. I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna get fucked immediately. All diamond cards are debuffed. What the fuck is debuffed? What is a debuff? Oh, I can't play them? Scores no chips and all abilities are disabled. Oh, oh, so I can still use it to make a hand. So like hypothetically, this is still a full house. Okay, it is. Does that disable the cards abilities? Or does it disable this ability? Is it still counted? We're gonna do learn a lot of shit. Playing this is gonna learn a lot of shit. I'm gonna learn a lot of things. Because I think they are still a five and they are still a diamond. I think that disables stuff like the molt and the bonus thing I just put on all my jacks. But we'll see if it activates this or not. Let's see if he goes off. No, they don't count as diamonds. Okay, so they don't trigger this either. Which is interesting because that theoretically means you couldn't flush with them. Of course, I drew the only debuffed one. We could just throw a flush at the board. Oh, round is not hand. Okay, I thought that was going to change. All right, so that sucks. So this just is off. This sucks. That's really fucking unfortunate. That's okay, because we're still going to have... This is going to be decently fat. I think we're probably like... We're on... We got three more hands. We'll make it. Oh, three of a kind. Do I want to just use this opportunity to dump these? Because if I play these, that basically just saves me a discard, right? Because these aren't going to do anything. I think I'll just play those that discard them. And let our kinglets go do kinglet things, and then hopefully get a three of a kind on queens. It's 
So yeah, so you can use hands as bonus discards. Oh, Jesus! Never mind, we're done. We're out. Fuck this. Holy shit. <laughs> Three of a kind is nuts. Okay. Never mind. I underestimated level four, three of a kind. Level four, three of a kind just fucking wins the game. Okay. We did not get the last voucher and we're not going to get this voucher either. Well, we might next time. Tarot cards appear two times. I don't want it anyway. Every played card permanently gains plus four chips when scored. Okay, so this rewards us for playing the same cards over and over again, which is kind of what we're working on. This joke against 0.05 molt for each card sold you can sell cards how do you sell cards brother i'm gonna sell half my fucking deck how do you sell a card i don't even know how to do that it was nowhere that was an option oh jokers uh i see i see okay dang it Oh, that's okay that's kind of and it resets in the boss blast defeat that seems really bad that seems horrible i mean i guess it's a multiplier on your multiplier i think it might be time to choose one of two spectral i don't know what a spectral card is what the fuck what a fucking spectral card is what's the spectral card What are these? <laughs> Converts all cards in hand to a single random suit. Add a purple seal to one selected card in your hand. Creates a tarot card with discarded. That's interesting. That's interesting. Just tarot card generation, because tarot card lets me fuck with my deck more. All right, how about... We throw this two of spades in the trash religiously. The problem is we have to draw it. It's one card. One more tarot cards. Tarot cards are fun. And this is planet cards to be used. No, I'll just keep going. Okay. Free spectral card. Get another spectral card. Two of the five planet cards add to your deck. The problem with this is if we're this this is just bad if we don't get like more jacks because we just want if my goal is to build one rank adding things that are not that rank is making the deck worse I think we want to fight this one for sure. Holy shit, 2,800 to 4,200. These are going up fast. I want to go to the store. I think I want to go to the store more than one of my special packs, so we're going to fight these. Hey, it's your boy! Three of a kind, Jackaroni! <laughs> it's the fella! Oh, that goes off immediately. Okay, that goes off instantly. <laughs> Ta da! <laughs> it's the thing the deck does. Okay, dope. I like it when the deck works. The Every master works all, you can't go wrong. What's up, Urela? Every played card counts in scoring. Negative plus one Joker slot, so it takes two, I assume, is what so it takes two Joker slots. So you can play them just for bonus chips. 40 chips for each remaining discard. Oh, it gives you a, wait, it gives you a slot? So this is free. Negative jokers just don't take a slot. They're just free. Holy shit. Well, we're obviously fucking buying that. Because that's fucking ridiculous. For completely fucking free. 
Okay, so negatives are amazing. Oh, we only got two of them. We could straight it up if we need to. Do you want you want hearts? Because I could straight it up with two hearts, and we could just go absolutely fucking ham slam, which too, that's an option. So I'll discard you three. Um for a nine or an, a nine and ace or a jack. I want to see a nine and ace or a jack. It's the ace of hearts. It's even the ace of hearts, man. All right, goodbye. This has been, it's been fun. Here you go. It's, it's even the ace of fucking hearts. Truly disgusting. Oh, not nearly as disgusting as I thought. I really underestimate how fucking powerful the three of a kind buff is. Okay, so leveling things seems like it's massive. I literally just thought it was instantly over. I was like, there's no way that's not a billion points. Hmm. That wasn't the multiplier. It wasn't either multiplier jack either. It was it was a chippy jack. I thought it was this guy. It was this guy. This guy's not nearly as good. Hmm. I really want three of a kind. So I feel like hanging on to the threes is good. Let's just... It's a hard mole for the thing that we do. Getting more threes. And I mean, if we pull out more jacks, I can do jack stuff. Got some heck and buff jacks. So I... Okay, we've reached a weird place where... I want to play a worse hand because I don't want to play a full house because my full house is dramatically worse than my three of a kind because the three of a kind is level four that's so weird it's weird to not play a full house full house is like big fucking that's true I want to play some extra fellas in here it's probably smarter to dump this guy because we'll get his bonus chips and there's only two more in the deck. Because we're already down one of them. There's also basically no 10s. So we'll throw these in. We'll throw in the jack and the 10. Just for some extra chippage. Right, I always want to play 5. I still want to splash. All right, there's the extra one that's not in. I'm looking at the row of jacks. But there's one off to the side. You're right. There's the side jack that was once a 10. I mean, we're going to be fine. But yeah, you're right. I can't play both nines because I don't want to make it a full house. All right. I don't know if there's any advantage to fucking nuclear scorched earthing the necessary score. But there you go. All right. We're still mostly cruising. As long as we can get three of a kinds because we like desperately need explicitly and exclusively three of a kinds. What the fuck is this? One in two chance to create a tarot card when your booster pack is opened. That doesn't seem very good. I could choose two of the five tarot cards. I'd like to use tarot cards. Tarot cards are fun and cool, and I want to see more of what they do. Converts up to three selected cards of spades. Make molts. Gold card. Which gives you three dollars if you keep it. Huh. That gives you straight money. Steal card one times molt when it stays in your hand. Doubling money. Okay. Okay, so the the, the, the tarot cards are not as much. I think there there aren't. I thought there was going to be a ton of shit that like changed rank. That was just like one specific thing. Not a lot of these do that, actually. Um. I guess I could make some spades just to enable like a little bit of flushing as a backup plan. Not that I really want a backup plan because three of a kind is so crazy. Hmm. Holding on to a card for free money is cool. Plus three bucks. That's that's pretty good. I'm not going to want to hold him, realistically. I'm going to want to play him. So I want to put it on something that's like, I can play it and it'll be okay if I need to. Like, it's still a good card, but... I can hodl it and not feel bad about not 
dumping it. Deck unlocked. There's decks. How can you have variant decks? It's a deck of playing cards, but there's not other decks. Fuck it, let's just throw the throw a backup plan in here. I don't really know what else I'm gonna do. I don't really wanna not super invest in any of the rest of these. We are now spadelets. It wasn't terribly helpful. All heart cards are debuffed. Well, good news. I just turned two hearts into spades. Bad news. You need to stop debuffing the suit that this thing wants me to play. You, you have to fucking stop. <laughs> I can't play both these against the full house. And I can't splash any of this shit. But I can use this as a free discard. So that works. Free discard. Go. Go, oh, my children. Give me a decent start. I can play a straight, but like... I don't think it's worth it. Because hmm. I could like hit one of these. That's not going to be great. It's a 30x8 because this is here. Okay, the problem with going big on the Jokers is I don't want to make a straight with them. Or Jax, rather. Because I don't want to use them for a straight. I want to keep them. We could fish for spades or Jax. Give me spades or Jax. Spades will do. Oh, it wasn't enough spades, actually. Am I stupid? Can I not count? God, well, two pairs, not that good. I feel like discarding two is not great. Because I'm holding two jacks. We could do two pair and throw in the ace for extra chips. I really don't want to two pair my fucking jacks. I want to throw these into like a mega hand. <sighs> 10 is bad because one of them turned into a jack. So 10 is like the least likely suit for us to three of a kind. This might be stupid, but uh, never punished. Go, my children. Commit flush. Never punished for my poor life choices. The fact that this has a 100% occurrence rate of being the same suit that the boss debuffs is extremely fucking bad. Brother, I fucking cannot get anything. More sevens or eights of the deck. Oh, they're sorted by suit. Oh, I see. I was so I'm so I was so fucking confused about this layout. All right, there's a ton of eights in the deck. Discard all this shit. All right, because I made a bunch of eights of spades. Oh, thank fucking god. Okay. Three discard. Three extra chips. Alright, I don't think this is going to save us, but it's gonna be decently big. It's gonna get us in there. It's gonna get us in the maybe zone, right? Jackson eight, so the two that we're swimming in right now. Save me. That saved us. Oh, we're fucking in there. Okay, so I wanna do a discard first because I wanna try and find the card that I'm supposed to hold in my hand. I don't get anything for keeping discards. I wanna try and find that one gold fucker. <laughs> Five of a kind. Five of a kind and four of them are the same suit. <laughs> we pulled this shit out at Vegas, and the dealer's like, wait a minute. Like, hold on. <laughs> wait a second. <laughs> I don't think that's supposed to exist. 
on a hidden hand type. I was thinking there's no way they don't give you the hand. Plus one hand size. Ooh, that seems that's really good. I want that one, so I kind of want to save for that. You trigger all cards played and finalize this to fucking save yourself. I want I want some dollars. I want this. Five of a kind flush. That was one card off being a five of a kind flush. <laughs> like it was, one of the eights was not a spade. It was really close to being a five of a kind flush. Okay. Next round. Who rolls the boss blind? All club cards are debuffed. Fucking stop doing that! <laughs> I just want to use my Joker. I'm gonna fucking sell this Joker. This Joker is useless. This thing is completely useless. This doesn't do anything. Cards drawn face down after each hand played? What? <laughs> the fuck does that mean? <laughs> it's a mystery card? I have to use the gotcha box? Yo, what do I have extras of? Tens are bad. Queens are bad. Fuck tiny cards. Discard all of this shit. Oh, this is the gold card, right? I want to hold on to that. So I don't want to... Out of curiosity, is this two pair or a flush? It's a flush, right? Because it's higher than two pair? Yeah, okay. You can't get both. Yeah, like, you don't, like, combine the multipliers. It's whatever the better hand is. Um. I could just play pair of twos. Oops, I could just do this. And use my hand like it's a discard. I'm using my hand like it's a discard. It's a ghetto ass discard. The tiniest little multiplier increase. Woo! All right. Can I fucking like? Can I fucking? This is not great right now. This is not going fantastically. I, I, I can't just keep blowing everything in pairs. Because I need to hang on to them to get three of a kinds. You might have to go. I might not be able to hang on to you this game. We'll see. You might, you might got to get Yoden. Ah, perfect. Throw them there for some juice. Uh, I don't want to keep him because he's got a very high chance of getting more because there's like five or six jacks in the deck and I've only drawn one. So I want to keep them so I can three of a kind. I want to keep you for obvious reasons. Greed. Greed simulator is go. The greed has entered the building. I want to discard you. I want to discard you. I want to discard you because I think there are literally no more nines in my deck. Okay, you get discarded and then something cool happens. The fool. It's me. I'm the fool. So I can make more spades. <laughs> can become the king of spades. Ugh. Like, this is getting rough. Still two kings. You gotta go, I'm sorry. How many queens are in the deck? Two. Agreed. If I die, I die. This is the learning run. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Behold. The power of fucking insurmountable greed. They called him the greediest man on planet Earth.
and thusly he was. We're in there. We're fucking it. Oh. Oh, oh, we're fucking in there. We're the most in there anybody has ever been. This is destructive levels of in there that shouldn't be possible. This is asininely in there right now. Thank you. Three dollars. Oh, we did it. We made it to three dollars. Greed rewarded. We're not going to make it much further. There's interest. There's interest. Feel like they, that's the thing they should have shared with the class possibly. Okay. So you have your fucking auto chess. You don't actually want to spend your money. You want to keep your money big. Well, I'm obviously buying this. You think I'm stupid? Like, like, I'm just... Yes, I'd like to buy $14 for $3. That sounds great. Um... <gasps> Money. Money. <laughs> Money. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Problem solved. All right. Now we have $50. Okay. All of a sudden, richness. So buy this. There's no thoughts head empty. If I stay above $25, I'll get max interest. Which would be kind of difficult to get below $25 at this point. I'd have to buy literally everything. Uh, so let's buy this Joker. Hearts or Molt. Oh, uh, let's buy a buffoon pack. Fuck it. Let's send molds to Hank and hands a flush. Joker, tarot, planet, and spectral cards may appear multiple times. A flush enabler, go. Okay, so now flushes are also all right. Flushes are also fine. We could also, I mean, guess we, I guess you could reroll. I don't know if that refills the slots I've already bought or just rerolls the ones that are already there, but I want to save up 25, so. Well, I guess we did 25 plus the money we'd get from this, so it should be fine. I mean, this, whether we even fucking win this is completely up in the air. I don't think we got massively stronger or anything. We just got a ton of fucking money, so we're just going to die hilariously rich. Never mind, we're fucking fine. Um... Say hard flush you can earn it. I don't think hard hard flush is good, but it's it's just fourteen. I mean, it, it'd be twenty, it'd be thirty molt. Like that's good, but like I think this shit's gonna go bananas. I think this times one point five on the end is gonna be worth a lot more than the plus four. This is gonna be a big open and fucking shot. I'll, this is gonna be a fat opening shot. How? What are you supposed to do with this? What the, how the, what the fuck do you do with this? Do I presume that they're in order? <laughs> like, it, it, it laced them through the hand. Oh, okay. So you can... All right. That's not... That is not random. You can still sort them. You can't see... So this is like... This is a king or an ace. Like 100%, this is either a king or an ace. God, it's really hard to tell which card goes where. 
It's this one on the end. I don't know how the sorting goes. Diamond is the last one. So this is the king or ace of clubs or diamonds. This guy, like, so hypothetically, you can do science. It's the king or ace of clubs or diamonds. What are my extra jacks? You can't, ah, oh, dang it. You can't just look in here. It doesn't show you the face down cards. You can't science it out with that. All right, all right, fair enough. Fair enough, you got me there. I can't count cards for it. It actually explicitly says at the bottom that it's like, yeah, I'm not showing you the face down cards in this. Uh, this is the ones you know you've used. Yeah, good effort, but no. So these are both twos or threes. I'm half inclined to just do this until I have enough cards that might be jacks. But like, well, okay, but actually, hold on. What that means is I can safely discard them. I can like discard this and I'm definitely not discarding a jack. Oh, you can put them up to keep track of where they are. Probably a spade. This might be a jack. Like I can disc, it's only when I play a hand, right? Yeah, okay, so I can discard all of this shit and then I'll get a bunch of face up cards and I'm definitely not discarding a jack. And I'm definitely not discarding an eight. I don't know what these two are, but we can possibly science it out with drawing more cards. Oh, this is a motherfucker. Hell yeah! It was the stamped two, baby! Okay, it was not a jack. I can make a jack right now. Would you like to be a jack, sir? <laughs> like, I'm also a serial king discarder, so I could just make an extra ace. So I can make another ten. That's, that's the worst thing I could do. Um, so you two are the four and five of spades. You literally have to be. These are the four and five of spades because they're in suit order. So this is a spade flush. This is guaranteed a spade flush. Are clubs? How could they be clubs? It's sorted. This is sorted by suit, you dingleberry. There's spades on both sides of it. If this isn't the four and five of spades, I do not understand how the hand sorting works. This, this like almost literally has to be the four and five of spades. Okay, yes. It's almost a straight flush. Might have been worth fishing for a straight flush, actually. I didn't even think about a straight flush. I kind of forgot that was a, but like a separate hand. Ooh, I like that there's a card in between the jack and the 10. Ooh, I like that. I like it. There's a card right there. That's interesting to me. Okay. These are both intriguing. This is definitely a 10. Cool, it could be a 9. Uh, it's a 9 or a 10. Shit. Oh, fuck me. That's a 9 or a 10. That's a 10 or a jack. I want to buff this 10 before I get rid of it. I, do want, I didn't forget about this. I was hoping to get another 10. <laughs> One of these could potentially be a 10 that could become a new jack. What's the sword order? Spades, hearts, clubs, diamonds. Could be the jack of spades. It could be the jack of spades. It could also be the ten of spades.
That's the ten or the jack of spades. Fuck, that's such a... I didn't narrow it down at all. Okay, that's the ten or the jack of spades, which is there's a huge difference. There's a huge difference between those two cards right now. One of them I want to play like this. One of them I want to zap with the strength. Could be jack of hearts. It can't be... Oh, yeah, it could be jack of hearts. It is above the ten. You're right. It, it's so... So there's a two-thirds chance this is the jack. There's a, This is either the ten of spades, the jack of spades, or the jack of hearts. There's a two and three chance this is a jack. There's a one and three chance it's a ten. Clubs or diamonds doesn't really tell me anything. There is not a 10 of clubs. This is a two thirds chance this is a nine. That's the nine of clubs, the nine of diamonds, or the 10 of diamonds. I think what we do is we strength these. Best case scenario, we get two new jacks. One in three chance. Worst case scenario, we get one new jack and a 10 that's not great, but can later be a jack. Either way, we get a guaranteed three of a kind of jacks. I can't play this right now because that would possibly, there's a two thirds chance that'd be a four of a kind jack. So I think the best shot right now is to zap both of these. I'm also science. I want to see if this flips over if I zap it. It was a jack! It was a 10, rather, it's a jack now! It was a 10! Okay, sick! <laughs> All right. <laughs> Is our deck free of 10s? There's one 10 of spades left. You try for five of a kind? No, because if we get four of a kind, we just fucking lose. Okay, <laughs> so we get four of a kind, we're done. Um, this is definitely three of a kind. This is very potentially a pair of jacks. And there are still two other jacks in the deck. So this is a two thirds chance of being a pair of jacks and there are more maybe jacks. We got to get a little lucky to win this. All right, this one going to take some thinking. So now we want to splash and we want to play hearts as much as we can. So we'll take this definitely hearts. I mean, nines are in the deck right now. Okay, so up to these next two cards could also potentially be nines, so we're going to discard this one too. That's true, it has to be a jack. I can tell now because... Okay, no, it did move back down. It did move back down. It's still a jack or a ten, yeah? Okay, dang it, that was a good point. We I hadn't resorted it since they got upgraded. It's, it kept the mystery box. It's still a Jack Area 10. It didn't tell us for sure. Okay, this is a definitive three of a kind. With a heart. And this was a diamond. Oh, and this was a diamond. Oh, my son. Oh, we're so in. <laughs> It could be anything. <laughs> it's the mystery box. I think I literally just discard. I'm honestly really tempted to just be like, bam, 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 and just fucking send it, see what I play. There's not a super low chance that's at least a pair of jacks. There are three jacks in my deck. Hmm, so we have our one mystery box, which was it's still a two-thirds chance of being a jack. I'm discarding the bottom five. Well, let's discard the top. I'm going to surround our jack with potential friendship. Do I learn what they are if I discard them? 
I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> no, you sure don't. <laughs> I have no idea what those cards were. <laughs> Fuck it, what's this shit? It's at least a pair of kings. It's two pair. It was a jack. Well, I don't know if that was a new card we drew or not. But the point is, we're good. Okay. Ooh! Face down make me think big. Hey! Thanks for whoever is using the Humble Bundle link. Appreciate it. Definitely real fucking spooky. The face down cards are making me use your brain. Face down cards make you think real hard. Well, I'm obviously going to buy this. <laughs> it could be anything. It could even be nothing. Welcome, Squidling. The squidding I'm obviously going to buy that. Dalgamir, 27 months in the pool. You with the shiniest squidling. Thank you for the prime support. I you enjoyed the content. Destroy it. Level of straight flush. Yeah, we play that one a lot. Um, I would like to destroy two cards that are not jacks or eights. That sounds good to me. We actually do not have that many eights because we don't have an eight of hearts or clubs. We just have four eights of spades. <laughs> like, it's just spades specifically very eight heavy right now. We do have seven jacks. So I would like to destroy some shit that isn't jacks. And then I think the money we get from playing the round counts before we get interest. So, um... Could look at the buffoon pack, or we could look at the planet cards. Hmm. Maybe we should get some planet cards. Oh, I still have a Joker slot actually, so let's get a let's get one of these. All face cards become gold cards when played. Whoa. That's gonna make me want to not play my jacks, though. Earn $5 of poker hands a full house. Poker hand changes for every, on every payout. These are both extreme. These are both phenomenal greed. These are, <laughs> These are both fucking phenomenal greed. This is the greed. This is the greediest shit I've ever seen. Okay, theoretically, if I get this weird, funny mask thing, this cha this changes every payout. So the, the it's not it's only full house right now. It's gonna keep picking random hands, I assume. We'll hit a saturation point of having so many gold cards that I can just play them because there will still be some left over in my hand later. I gotta pick one, right? Okay. Spectral pack. Next base edition shop joker becomes negative. Oh, we can get another one. We can get a seventh joker. <laughs> we can get a seventh joker. Oh, we're fucked. Oh, we're just, we're fucked. We're fucked. We're, oh, we're fucked. This, it's gonna, this guy's gonna eat my ass. We're fucked. There's no, there's not a unit. There's no fucking chance we beat that. <laughs> Oh, we're fucked. We're like fucked, fucked. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a good run. It was a good. It was a good first run. But like, yeah, we're 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 deado. There's no fucking chance we get through that. This is this thing's gonna eat my entire anus. Give me a spectral pack. And give me something insane. Give me something fucking crazy. Add polychrome to a random joker, destroy all other jokers. What times 1.5 molt? That's horrible. Add a gold 
three dollars this card is played and scores done that guy oh shit is i gonna lose the molt no okay 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 i think it's i think you can have like an if i don't know i don't know if there's a limit i don't know how many things we can stack on a card i haven't really tried yet Tarot card, please. Oh, we can also... We, oh, hold on, we can hanged man. We can just nerf two of these. Does not, does not refill the hand. In case you were curious, does not refill the hand. Tarot card, please. Jax, please. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight jacks. How much is five of a kind worth? The problem with five of a kind is that we don't have our jacks for anything later. What do you want? Spades with one. Because five of a kind isn't massively better than three of a kind, and it cost me two more jacks. Because this is not a small number. I got to get to a pretty big number. I think it's much better to do two three of a kind than it is to do a five of a kind. Also, I should do this. So we can spread the molten the chip bonus around, I think. And then you want spades? There you go. Merry Christmas. Put them at the back of the bus. There we go. Should be good. Did I use one with the three on the left? How the fuck are the three on the left? This just gives me money. How's the three on the left gonna be 16 and a half grand? Am I like massively far off? Oh right, then they turn gold too. Because greed simulator. How on earth were you getting 16,500 out of the three on the left? Would like another jack, please. More jacks! Waiter! More jacks, please! That's not jacks. I just play this. It's, uh, it's not good, but I've only got two discs. This is like a discard, but you play it. It's going to be the tiniest amount of gas. Because we're kind of low on discards. This is a discard that will also give me, like, I don't know, 300 points, maybe. <laughs> it's not going to be good, but... <clears throat> How many kings are in the deck? Just the one. How many queens are in the deck? Two. I have none spades, because I did just eat them all. I got my boys the fucking eights. His brothers in spade will arrive, hopefully. Let's do that, I guess. Not good, but I don't know that we're getting there. I think Jack's supremacy is not strong enough. Oh, the gold. Oh, 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 okay. No, you, the gold card gets rid of the multiplier and the booster and stuff. Oh, I did not. Okay. You know, there is a limit. There is a limit to what you can have on it. So I imagine you can have like one effect on the card and then one stamp. Probably that was my thought. 
when I put the gold stamp on the other thing. I did not realize that was removing all of the buffs that gave us the stuff that makes us actually win. That's bad. We are actually running low on jacks, so I'm gonna throw the jack in there. Yeah, we are uh, actually mega fucked. All right, that did not, that was, that ate the shit out of our score. Okay, so that's actually even more dangerous than I thought. I thought I was gonna slap gold. I mean, we're fucked with the boss anyway. I thought I was gonna slap gold on top of the existing effects, but no, you cannot stack them. This is the learning round. It's where we learn. Oh, six of diamonds already gone, damn it. Ace of diamonds isn't, though. There's only 12 cards left in the deck. Decent chance I draw. There are not more queens. That's actually, we have all the queens. Oh, we're fucked. We're like fucked, fucked. Straight flush! Carry me by just being a good hand, please. I was like, surely, I didn't look at it, but surely straight flush has got to be pretty good on the value department, right? Like, it's a fucking straight flush. Not really, no. Save me. Save me, Spadelet. The brothers in eight have come together to join us. Oh yeah, the flush guy triggered with- oh, hand contains a flush. Oh, okay. That's true, this, the flush guy triggered on straight flush. It's a different hand. Carry me. Carry me. A stone-faced joker man with a ton of eights of spades specifically. <sighs> Thank you. I mean, we're not beating- it's not like we're beating the boss, but you know, here we are. You have to fucking, you gotta fucking go, dude. You can't, you gotta leave. This guy can't stay here. This man is a, this is a curse. You gotta fucking go. This thing is fucking cursed. Okay. Stop making gold cards. I don't know how we survive this. Honestly, I just don't think we do. Maybe we, like, leveling up two pair, two pair is the worst possible hand. Two pair is the worst possible secondary hand behind, like, full house to go into because it eats potential three of a kinds. Save me, tarot cards. Save me. Three cards become diamonds. Two planets. Gives $13. Save me, planets. The two... The two worst... Possible hands. <laughs> Literally... The worst things that could conceivably happen. The one that contained... Well, but, but I need... But still, I can't play three of a kind more than once. So, like, I mean, well, I'll take fucking anything at this point. I'll take fucking anything. We actually probably want to aim to use the jacks for a four of a kind or a five of a kind because we can't duplicate hands. But like, we're fucked. Like, we're just, we're fucked. We're not, it's not coming back. We're not coming back from this. Save me, planets. We're going to make the four of a kind at least a little bit fat. Four of a kind's pretty fat now. Question, does this refresh the shop? No, it does not. <sighs> Holographic? Level up the four of a kind again. Level up the four of a kind. You fucking sent it. Get the four of a kind in there. All right, four of a kind is on the same rank as three of a kind now. Four of a kind's thick. All right, hold on. Hold on. Mars is here. Mars is here, everybody. What the fuck do you do? Odd ranks give 30. Sure, get in there. I don't know what the fuck holographic means, but get the fuck on the board and help me. Please, God, save me. Okay. 
Now we have two viable hands instead of one. Oh, holographic plus 10 mold. Just like passively? Like it's just... Holy shit. Oh, okay. Wait, wow. Odd ranks include jacks? You'd fucking think. But no. It says ace9753 right there. You did not... We're not, we're not in jacks or 11 school. Jacks or jacks. They don't... They're not a number. J is not an odd number. Okay. So we can't repeat hands. Which means I should take the opportunity. I guess it'd be better to just do this. We should take the opportunity to rather than discard, at least get some value out of a straight. We need some degree of value because we're going to need to play like a three of a kind and a four of a kind. None of these are my mega repeat cards. Jack and eight are the two and eight did not go fantastically. Jack and eight are the two I want to go for a three and four of a kind on. This is not just none hearts. <laughs> it is two clubs. Let's do it this way. This isn't going to be a lot, but it's not going to be nothing. It does have quite a few odd cards in it. That w okay, hold on! Hold on! You're saying there's a chance. All right. This, this motherfucker right here is about to carry us over the fucking finish line. If we get there, it's thanks to my boy, Odd Todd. That's our only fucking way we're in there. They just handed me another fucking straight. Okay, we want clubs. I could two, I could two pair, but I don't want to spend the... Discarding a two is rough. We already used the two, but it could be a full house enabler since we can't repeat scoring types. A fat club flush could just carry us on multiplier alone. It's also, oh, it's even, it's even. It's not odd, I'm not, so I'm stupid. Okay, there's three of a kind. Or full, three of a kind or full house. I don't really want to use you on three of a kind. Oh, this really eats our fucking flush, club flush potential, but... The times 1.5 multiplier on the back end of... Oh, we really need the four of a kind. We really need to get a four of a kind. What do I fucking do? <laughs> yeah, four of a kind straight better than three of a kind. Oh, what do I fucking do? Do I discard the eight of spades? That feels massively wrong. It feels so insanely wrong to discard the eight of spades. But I need more draws. I have to get we have to four of a kind with the joke with the jacks, or we're not gonna make it. We have to four of a kind with the jacks. I have to hard fish. Also, the club flush is gonna be pretty fat. It's currently a lot of fucking even cards, unfortunately. How many clubs are left in the deck? Not fucking many that aren't also jacks. All right.
This sucks. <laughs> oh, this sucks. I discarded an eight of spades. I drew an eight of spades. Come on. Okay. How much this hand specifically is worth is going to determine whether we have literally any chance of making this. This is the fact that gold overrode our multiplier enablers is so fucking bad. This is this is pretty much got to carry us. This is this carries us or it's over. Nah. It's not bad. All right. Now what? There's three queens left and two kings. Yes, that's fair to do. There's only two aces. This would have been so free yeah, if the gold mask had not overrode all my multipliers. I think we would have been in there. This is my last discard. I think I have to just send it and pray. The slap this discard and just fucking prage. There's three nines in the deck. I don't know. I should discard the nine, actually. Carry me, tarot card. Okay, I have several two pairs I can pick from. Almost got a flush, but I have to get rid of it. Creates a random joker card, must have room. Can a random joker card save us? <laughs> Is there a chance a random joker card gets us out of here? I don't know, it could be anything. <laughs> could even be useful. I have room, that's why I would get rid of one. Have we outgrown this lad? Should he go? The random joker could be under Midas. Midas is already for already fucked. It doesn't matter. Droll Joker honestly seems like he's the worst. Ten molt if we play a specific hand that we're not built for. Save me. Save me, judgment. There's a red rectangle. Three molt when a booster pack is skipped. <laughs> Great. Awesome. Super useful right now. It really helps. Okay. God, I know. Fuck me, dude. <laughs> All right. I have a plan. It's not good and you're not gonna like it. It's, it's very bad, but I have a plan. I have a thought. I have a thought. It's just a very, very bad thought. It's like a discard, but you get a couple of points for it. I'm only keeping you for the club flush stream. There are no more sixes in the deck. We cannot get a three of a kind six. There are two nines and two queens. Two is a club. There's an argument for this. This is, I'm, all, I'm only on the fence here. I'm on the fence about whether this guy's included. Because, like, this makes it a pair versus fucking high card. But, I mean, it's just a discard anyway. Like, this is, a, it's a slough that cost me one of my hands. If I punch myself and it hurts my strong or weak. 
existential problems humanity deals with on a daily basis. I think we keep the club and we play. <sighs> no, we don't. The club's not going to save us. What have I played? I don't. We've played three of a kind. We've played straight. We've played three of a kind and straight. This is the only two we've played. I think we fish for club flush. And we now we've played high card. I mean, I think we're probably fine. Motherfucker. All right. Fucking club flush. Let's... Go get him, club flush. I think the club flush is better than the full house. Because my full, my full house is level two. Let's see. This is the multiplier is going to go up by 1.5 every single card. So it's four, and it's going to be six, and then it's going to be nine, and then it's going to be 13.5, and then it's going to be like 20, and then it's going to be like 30. Because of Ancient Joker, is my thought. So the other option is this. Just a very slightly higher base score. This gets hearts twice. So it's going to be 10. It's going to be 14. It's going to be 21. It's going to be like 30. Okay, it's actually very similar. It's very similar. I can't play three of a kind. We've already played. Have we not played three of a kind yet? <gasps> Have we not played three of a kind yet? Oh, I thought we blew three of a kind already. Oh, never mind. We just do this. We haven't blown our three. Right, because we, we, we saved for the four. This is going to be nine. It's going to be 13. It's going to be 17. It's going to be like 30. <laughs> with way higher base value. Yeah, we play this. 100% it's this. It's this every fucking time. It's absolutely always this. 1 million percent it's this. This is this is gets us in there. There's no way this doesn't get us in there. Oh, also the dots. Also the odds. The nines are odd. Nine is an odd number. Oh. We're so in there. We're so in there. Holy fuck, we actually beat him. Jesus. Hey, thanks for carrying me, Odd Todd. Thanks for being literally the only reason I'm still here. All right. Minus one anti, minus one hand per round. No. I mean my Okay. That seems rough. That means that I have to, I have to like skip every blind. I have to fucking skip every blind. I cannot fight blinds anymore. <laughs> Todd dragging squid's lifeless body across the finish line. <laughs> Played face cards. My, my son. My son. The crazy jack enabler you are, you rat bastard, you. Smoly. Holding kings. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, your ass is. Get the fuck out of here. These are both interesting. Because I still have, I have three of my kings. I don't know what happened to my... Oh, I turned my king of spades into a jack. We don't have a ton of kings. 
I think it's time for my boy to go. I think we double buy these. These seem like they're really fucking hot, honestly. Multipliers in the back, flats in the front. I don't think it matters because they're both based on scoring. Um, You know, I'm a big tarot card enjoyer. Do any of you make more jacks? Yeah, you do. <laughs> or, or that could double or nothing. <laughs> we can make another jack or we could double or nothing. I don't know. We, it could be anything. It could even be two more jacks. We could we can fucking gamba. Anything's possible. But what if I turned this two of clubs into a check? Unless queen feels so good. I have four queens. Why would I want to get rid of the queens? The queens are fine. The twos are like, I have only three of them and one of them really wants me to discard it. Twos are the poo-poo card. Nines are also somehow doing fine. Honestly, nines are fine. I have one ten. There's one ten in the deck because they've all been turned into jacks. Tens and twos are my dumpsters. Where's the left card and the right card? Bing, bing. Jack. I cast my most powerful spell, Jackify. <laughs> like it's... Flush well, seems like it could be okay. We're very spades and diamonds heavy on account of all the... F Somehow spade, the million eights of spades are just carrying this entire fucking suit. I'll take the flushy boy. I guess Jack. But the power invested in me by having nine jacks. <laughs> I guess jacket. Go. Okay. First hand is drawn face down. Oh, that's way less bad than the previous ones. I'll just discard as much of it as possible. Spectral pack. Add a voucher to the next shop. I do have a lot of money. I could fight this. These are weird. I could fight this for some cash, because I'll get interest. And then I could skip this. And then if we win, I'll have two vouchers, and I'll probably be able to easily buy both. But, um... If I want to buy this round's voucher, I have to do it here. But I don't, because it's scary. It's, it's terrifying. I don't want to buy it. <laughs> this game is so good, though. It, dude, it's pretty good. I'm having a good time with this. Who do you want today? You want spades? Okay, so what do we got? Three of a kind, four of a kind are jacked. Full house and flush are okay. Um, bah, 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 bah. Yeah. Be gone, peasants. Squidling to the squiddy pool. <laughs> Y'all ever see we a three of a kind that? flush? <laughs> Can zone 64 months in the pool. You with the shiniest squidling. I like the jack that's gold and has a gold stamp because I get three dollars if I play it or if I don't play it. Okay, it's just Splash Mo. Splash my balls. Splashma. I like being splashed. Thank you, Face McFacey. I appreciate you. He's fucking almost 8k. You want to hodl this guy because he gives us 1.5 multiplier, so bingus, bingus, ba ba bingus. Goodbye, my friends. Need room for more jacks and eights. Where are the eights, Sharon? Where are my fucking eights? The hell? Brother. I mean, I'll just start using hands as discards. I'm not worried about this at all. This should be 
super easy. What the fucker? <laughs> Alright, shitty pair it is. Let's go. Give me more jacks. I have more jacks than, like, than eights, right? That's pretty even, actually, but the jacks are stronger. Alright, honestly, what's insane is I still think we're gonna... Like, not even remotely struggle with this. Ah, oh, shit. These are the spades. Except I'm in the back. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Give me a... What are my fucking jags? Don't make me fucking three of a kind, the kings. That's not the thing I wanted to do. I'll do it, though. I'll three of a kind of fucking kings. What, you think I want three of a kind of kings? You think I'm some kind of a pussy baby? You think I want three of a kind of these fucking kings? I'll three of a kind of shit out of these kings. I don't need to hold them forever. Multipliers. I always forget about this guy. Heart's not really... Well, you're next to go. Heart's not really the thing that we do. I don't know if you've noticed. I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. I love this card. I want to keep as many as possible. Okay, let's actually be conservative here. So far, this stream has been jazzed rough. But do you think I can keep all of these? Hello. How many of these jacks do you think I can keep? And still win. I only need like 1700. Because the jacks are worth $3 if I don't play them. So. All right. So this is two, six, ten. And this is, so it's like 300, one odd. So this will be 60. This is 10, this is 20. Man, I, th I don't think it makes it. Oh, that's five. <sighs> Let's just be safe, I guess. I guess we'll just be safe and play three of the jacks. I don't think the one pair made it. I think it was close, but I don't think it would quite make it. We'll be fucking safe. Two pair almost certainly would have made it. I could have made three additional dollars, but I would have felt really fucking dumb if it somehow didn't. Thank you. Give my monies, please. My interest, nine dollars. Two chips for each remaining card in the deck. Ah, literally just you, but better. It's his cooler brother. Okay, one of five planets, two of five planets. I'd like to buy, all, I'd like all these planets. Planet me up, homie. Make the three of a kind stronger. Do I want to make the four of a kind stronger? Yeah, I do. We have enough jacks. I think I can go for four of a kinds at this point. It's the guy who does nothing about this game. I'm very confused. We're just playing poker, Kanzons. Just poker, dude. You never played poker before? Is this your first day in America? Um... Five of a kind. <laughs> Could level up five of a kind. Do we want to level up four of a kind or do we want to level up flush? Oh, it's planet X. Because we can make four of a kind fucking bad shit. Or we can make flush viable. Two molten 15 chips is not fucking bad. Just stack Mars. 
Yeah, stick to the plan. Stick to the plan. The plan is that our four of a kinds immediately win the game. Why do anything with the bad shit thing? Good question. Okay, now we're skipping this guy. And then we're fighting this, and we're starting with a face down hand. So this is unfortunate, uh, because we have no fucking clue what's in here. Very possible we discard. So, here's the thing. If I discard, it's a mystery forever. If I just play whatever the fuck this is, <laughs> we'll at least see them now. I think we just discard these and then use the information from our new five to sort of try to figure out. Is that five jacks? Or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> that sure looks like a five of a kind jack to me. Do you think he triggers off face down kings? Like an odd number, please. Are you spades? One of you two might be a spade. Do you think he triggers off face down kings? Do you think if one of these is a king, he'll go off? Five guys is fun if I jack, 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 and jack. All right, we have at least one more jack. Possibly up to three more jacks. We don't fucking know. Jackma. And so the boys approach the field of battle ready for fucking action okay so i think those are kings and the answer is no it could be two more queens that's possible it's two more queens never remember the order spade heart club diamond so this is a spade, could be either. This is a diamond. We do not have a king of spades. We don't have a king of spades. The king of spades got turned into a jack. This is the queen of spades. That right there is 100% the queen of spades. This is a full house. Which is not great, but is at least level two. But it's just way worse than playing three of a kind, right? Well, we can play this. Because even if it is a king, it's not scoring. This is either going to make our hand a full house. Be cool for us. Or just add some fucking points. It's a spade, so it'll trigger Ancient Joker. It's definitely, we know it's a spade. This is either going to be a three of a kind or a full house. Um, I think we're fine either way, honestly. It's a three of a kind. We're fine. Wait, how is it a diamond? What the fuck? Oh, no, this one's a spade. Add him backwards. This one's the queen of spades. My bad. I got the two face down cards mixed in my head. So we know this is the queen of spades. We have 100% confidence there. Which means we can go bing, bang, boom, bing, bong. Put the spadey boys at the back. Take another three of a kind. Just fucking keep firing the three of a kind cannon. With a, with a bunch of odds. With a bunch of odds. Oh, with all the oddities the world has ever fucking seen. It's so odd. Holy shit. Okay. I forget about Odd Guy. I keep forgetting about Odd Guy. Dude, Odd Guy's a homie. Odd Guy's a real fucking homie. Reroll boss blind one time per any cost 10 bucks. Okay, reroll a blind that will just kill you. Seems pretty good. Playing cards you purchased from the shop. Maybe Jax. Maybe Jax in the store. Fuck. <laughs> Plus one hand size. 
plus 20 molt, minus 4 molt per round played. Okay, this encourages us to skip blinds, but is pretty solid, honestly. I don't hate this. We're in any seven, so if we just fight the bosses, it's only two. So it would go down to plus 12. Oh, it doesn't cost a slot, right? I was going to say this has fallen off, but it doesn't cost a slot. It's about guaranteed to be better than Wrathful Joker in pretty much all situations. We would have to be playing like a fucking spade flush for Wrathful Joker, but we like, we have to fucking skip blinds or sell it. The king, yeah, that's right. King in hand, well, the thing about king in hand one is it applies at the very end and it's a 1.5 to our total multiplier. So like it, it doesn't, when it goes off, it's fucking huge. Like it's the last thing that happens is after everything else adds into our multiplier, it goes another one and hits it with a 50% increase. But we got to hold a king. Holding a king's rough. Because I want to play three of a kind of four of a kind. I want to play really big hands. You know what they say about guys with big hands. Okay, I'm going to pick the re-roll a boss that's just going to kill me automatically. I think this might be remembered as unwise, but I think popcorn is better. I can always sell this. If, it, if, we, if we can't end up skipping a bunch of blinds, we'll just sell it. Five dollars per skip blind is worth thirty bucks. And free jokers. Thirty bucks. Thing is you have to fight. Cards previously played this anti are debuffed. <gasps> Brother. You don't know how fucked you are. You do not have a boss ability. You've you're, you have been deleted. You do not possess a boss ability. Sorry to tell you, you don't get to play this time. You're just a regular fucking hand of Baladro with a huge number attached to it. Okay. Four chips if played hand has exactly four cards. Okay. This is fine. I just have to stop playing. I don't have a lot of time to build it up, but it starts at plus 50, which is like, all right, I suppose. But then the, maybe it kills itself. Ten four. Hmm. Are you better than anything I have? Everything I have adds to the multiplier. The adding to the chips is also good though. The chips number also wants to be big. And you start at 66. I don't have a lot of time to build you up. And especially because the, I would be swapping the popcorn bucket for you. Like realistically, you would just be replacing the popcorn bucket and you'd be a chip builder instead of a malt builder. I think I just skip this. <laughs> like, doesn't feel good to skip it. I'm just gonna pass. Thanks. Chip over king. I think the king's better than you think it is. Okay. This is a big ass number. <laughs> I need. What happens is I need to get some kings in my hand. Actually, what do you want? You want hearts? I've only got one extra eight. I don't know why I'm so attached to keeping eights. I'm so attached to keeping eights because they're just slightly more common. But honestly, I think I should just eat it. It's just because it, having an extra card in the deck means that I'm more likely that I'm going to get four of a kind opportunities. Because now we really want to go for fours. Our fours are buffed as shit. I'm not discarding any hearts. 
This period of Stanley is in you, eight. Not a king. Commit to the bit. We discarded one eight, we're discarding all the eights. We just have a normal number of queens, right? We don't have any extra queens now, okay. Let's drop a three of a kinder in here, throw the odd boy on there, and give him a heart for the multiplier. Kills our four of a kind potential, but like we kind of got to start playing stuff. We got to start hitting buttons. And we really want to do it while we got the kingies. This is going to be pretty solid. There's three hearts in here. Pretty okay, actually. More than half on the first hand. Still five jacks in the deck. If I discard the aces, I'm going to draw aces. That's just the law of the world. If I discard the fucking aces, I'm going to get more aces immediately. But we are here to fish for one hand. We have done this to ourselves. We made a deck that does one thing. Oh, I should have cut the five. Now that's bad. Don't get me wrong. We're just using hands as discards now. My deck is like 50% jacks. <laughs> Half of the deck is jacks. I think we just have enough raw bullshit that this honestly is not even going to be the worst thing in the world. It's going to be bad, but... Why is he triggering before these guys? Uh, GG will play, thank you. Ah, oh, we're like one off lethal. All right, that's fine. I will make the funny. Um, I will make. I need literally three hundred points. What if I just play all of these cards and tell you to go fuck yourself? How's that sound? Throw a queen in there for good measure. Throw a little bit of fucking extra mustard there. Get my three hundred points and get my twelve dollars. Twelve dollars, please. What was that about the fucking King's Joker not being good? I'm sorry, but somebody said something about the King's Joker not being good. Someone wanted to get rid of this. Sorry, that. who was that? Someone wanted to get rid of the card that increases the multiplier of our hand by 125%. Not to 125%, but by 125% to 225%. And that's not even drawing the other one. There is the third. There was another. Someone's like, oh, I don't know, man. Multiplying your whole multiplier by 150% of, for holding one fucking card doesn't seem very good. <laughs> Rerolls are cheap. That could be good. That could. I would have to reroll. I think it's too late for this. Um, I'd have to reroll five times to be worth it. I have a bunch of fucking money. I could. <laughs> what? If the first hand of a round is a singles, this would be cool early. I heard there were tarot cards. Fuck me. <laughs> I 
I don't need all. I do not. No, it's max 20. This is why there's a cap. One in four chance that foil holographic or polychrome to random joker. No, I want more tarot cards. My tarot card could be two tarot cards. Taking my molt cards back and I can do nothing. Mo uh, let's. Okay. I can't use you because there's nothing out. Can I use this while this is open? I can, okay. Where are all the fucking jacks? He wants diamonds this game, so fuck it, both these two. <laughs> and then I can use now because this would replace it. Yeah, let's do this. Use this. Make you molt instead of gold. Take this shitty fucking three. Make it a jack. More jacks, father. I require more jacks. Well, I mean, that is the thing that we do. <laughs> it's like, that's pretty good. The fact that for some reason this always goes after this, I don't know why, it does make this much worse than I thought it was. Hey, popcorn, it's been fun, buddy. <laughs> like, but you know. You know, the contains, so four of a kind also counts. We're obviously fucking buying this. Make everything you play ridiculous. Okay. What the fuck? Plus 20 mold if I just play three of a kind. <laughs> Plus 20 molt on three of a kind is not a bad joker either. I don't think it's that great though. Hence the number of times poker hand has been played to the molt. It probably has to build up. Go up to minus 20. <laughs> Okay. You know what contains a pair? It's actually both three of a kind and four of a kind, but it's only eight molts. It's not a huge bonus. Four of my jacks are diamonds. I think we just go. I think we just go. Is there a five of a kind hand in this game? Yeah, there is. By the way, the thing is buffing diamonds this game. Four of my ten jacks are diamonds. I love how spaced out the hearts have to be because there's only fucking nine of them in the deck. That's scary. That's a little scary. But I don't think we're overly reliant on one Joker that isn't Todd. Um, Todd getting disabled, it's a little scary, but it's every hand, so we can just play a trash hand when Todd is offline. We can just play something kind of dookie when Todd's out of business. Okay. All right, let's think. 100K is a lot. If I skip both of these, I have plus three hand size for what I believe is the final boss. We're on 88. If I skip both, I get nothing from this because the game is over. But I will have plus three hand size for the boss. 
Is that better than going to the store twice? Probably not. But maybe. I don't know. Is two shops or plus three hand size going to make us stronger? Shops? Shops could mean the deck is more jacks. Shops could put more jacks in the deck. I like more jacks. The problem is it is getting kind of hard to make jacks because one of the arcana cards is plus one rank and there's only one 10 in the deck because all the rest of the 10s have already been jacked. You could reroll the boss. I don't think I want to. I can only reroll the boss once. And this seems very work. This seems very fightable. And if I re-roll it into like Jax or debuffed or something, we just fucking lose. I think it's better to fight it out. I think it's better to fight it out. Holy shit, we almost drew an opening hit with no Jax. What a shit opening hand. What a terrible fucking opening hand. Go, my children. Be free. Be the oddest of Todd's. Why would I play a two pair when I could fish for a three of a kind? Three of a kind does stuff. That's pretty fucking nuts. Stop right there, criminal scum! Like the otter Todds, please. Let's get the odd boys in there. Dead baked potato. One, two, three, four. You were the shiniest squiddling. Hands on, thank you for the donk. Appreciate it. 27 months in the pool, potato. You're very baked at this point, or very moist. One to two. Okay, yeah, I don't see a reason I'll just fire this one off. Um, fire the crackhead cannon, go. That very possibly just wins. You little mother bitch. You fucking bag with which one douches. I really want to just play a nine and see if it wins. I'm pretty sure I actually think I just win by just playing a nine. Oh, I didn't. I, I meant to click on that and then this. That was my bad. Well, now we're going to play a golden nine just for shits. <laughs> Here's your fucking card. Fuck you. I'm minus three dollars because I meant to put it on the queen. Oh, well. Could have had three more bucks. Could have had 50... Could have had fucking $65 instead of $62. Jumbo Celestial Pack. All right, hold on. Everybody, everybody, hold on. It doesn't stack with itself. It's not per time. It's if. It's an if-then statement. But this is the equivalent of Baron while holding two kings. And also, this just changed because I played a hand right. I like the flexibility Ancient Joker gives me, but this is the equivalent to Ancient Joker or Baron going off twice. Like, that's... Ooh, I don't know. That's tough. Let's go here for sure. Okay, step one. Is there a skip button? Okay, there is a skip button. So I can open the pack, and if the pack doesn't give me something that I want, I can skip. That is to say, anything not a jack. That's actually true. This hits itself. So uh, you're right. This one hitting it. These are both better than having two. Two, two of these is stronger than this. So I can hit this. If there's not a jack in it, I can just skip. 
Oh, they have effects and stuff. Oh, what the fuck? I didn't know they'd come with perks. There's a lot of perks. Okay. So, there's an argument for the King of Spades because of Baron. Drafting the King is not horrible. Is it, wor is it worth making my deck slightly thinner for Jax? Maybe. Putting back the fourth king and, it, I, and somewhat in, in universal karma, replacing specifically the king of spades who got deleted from the earth to become a jack. <laughs> like the return of the king seems pretty good. I think that's worth putting in the deck. Oh, that was a reroll. But the odds of me playing this are nearly zero, but like, I mean. Fucking, I'd rather have it and not need it than need it and not have it. I'd have to reroll too many times for that to become valuable, I think. Alright, let's move on. We're fighting everything for stores. We're just getting a bunch of fucking money. You are on clubs. Bing, bong, bing, bong, bing, bong. There you go. Oh, I almost said play hand. Don't play hand. Throw it in the trash. That's garbage. Put it out. Put it in the dumpster. Where are my fucking yaks? My yaks, please? Thank you. You're better in the hand. Uh, that's probably good there. Some free chips. Thank you. Not a single thing to feed uh, Todd. Todd's just living his life doing Todd stuff. That's okay. It's honestly getting a little bit sketchy. I'm starting to question our ability to get to 100k on the boss fight. I mean, not like starting. I was, it was already very much in question, but... Certainly spooky. Okay, we don't want to throw out the Triple King yet. Triple King is a closer. There's still six jacks in the deck. You can stay. One, two, three, four, eights. Now we're hard mauled for jacks. I gotta let go of this weird jack attachment. <sighs> That's so crap. It's so poop anus. Keeping the six of clubs is incredible greed. Why do you trigger first? It says they trigger left or right. That's just like, that's just false. They don't. They don't trigger left or right. This is lies. This is an outright fabrication. That's big. Turns Baron off for the game, though. It is big, though. Like, that's... That's big fucking pointus right there. Three of a kind with three of the fucking clubs on there. That's gonna go pretty nut burgers. Uh, we'll fucking do it. I think we have, we have three hands left to play. We should be fine. I am remiss to get rid of the kings, but sometimes you gotta get rid of the kings. Sometimes the kings are not meant to be part of this world. They've done their job. 
Also, this is a hilariously overpowered hand. This is truly fucking disgusting. Guys, I think this is going to be at least 9,000. I'm not sure. I don't have complete confidence, but I, I should use my discard to fish for more gold cards for extra money, but whatever. I'm not at that level of thinking about the optimizations yet. We did it. I mean, that was 100k right there. That was without the boss penalty, but like... You know, we might make it. We might... We might make it, guys. We might be good to go. High card. Oh, it doesn't reroll the packs. It only rerolls these. Oh, no. Okay, well, we'll buy the packs then. Wild Jack? Welcome to the team, buddy. Okay, <laughs> welcome on in, my guy. That's apparently a thing that there is. Yeah, have a nice day. Thanks. Wild card coming. Can't fit it, damn it. Joseph J. Joker. Base cards. Okay, yeah, this is all. These are all just farmers. All right, that's it. Jack of X. Pretty good addition to the deck. I'll take it. I can also X something else, too. We'll hang on to this for a moment of need. Um, if we need to whip out a fucking flush or something, this is an emergency salvation card. All right, final battle. You fucking nuked the Todd immediately. You bitch! They feared him. They feared Odd Todd. I'll play three odds in his honor. So we can hard mull. I'd rather do this, actually. Keep this so when when Odd wakes up. We can have his Odd powers. Wait, does he still keep his 10 molt? It says all abilities are disabled, but it says 10 molt on the side. That might... Okay. Okay, we'll start with a dookie-ass hand because we need to get Todd undisabled. Todd needs to wake the fuck up. I need that 10 molt. That 10 molt's nice. I'm curious if it will still add the holographic effect. I assume I'll be very surprised if it does. It does not. Okay. Oh, great. Splash me down's fantastic. Okay. Don't have any. None of these are diamonds. I actually know Splash is what lets me play things to trigger Ancient Joker. Ooh. It's a little rough, actually. I don't have any eights drawn yet. It's just the one. Oh, I did draw an eight already. Nope, eight's out of here. Get out of here. I already played an eight. Fuck you. And then I, do I, I think this is probably the best use of the wild. Stop right there, criminal scum. This is probably the best use of the wild. I can wild this into being diamond. I'll wild the jack for 50% more multiplier. Our four of a kind multiplier is way higher than our, our five of a kinds actually suck. We don't want to play five of a kinds. I think this is, I don't think we're gonna get a stop right there, criminal scum. A better use. 
Oh, that terrified me for a second because it fucking stopped being gold. And I was like, what the boy, what happened? But then it gets rid of the gold. I don't know who gives a shit about the fucking gold. Kizrune, Heronara, 14 and 25 months in the pool. You guys are the shiniest squidlings. Thanks for hanging out. Enjoy your hands. Canzone's got them for you. Canzone handing out fucking dunks. Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Wish I could stick this on there, but no splash. These are, these are, we want these two disabled. These are our weakest two cards. So we want these two to be, go away. Down a Joker is a, so this is a bigger force multiplier than I thought because I didn't realize how hard it synergizes with Ancient Joker. Do I want to, no, the question is, do I want to discard first for more kinks? Because if I discard these three and I pull another king, we get fucking 50% more multiplier and that's really, really good. Oh, that's true. I get odd. You're right. I, should, I can add in the nine to trigger odd Todd. You're right. No, I don't, I don't splash. Shut up. You're dumb. I don't think it's worth the discard. I think I need to go with this. I can't greed for the biggest possible hands. I just need pretty big hands. They don't have to be the biggest hands that have ever existed. Because we're halfway there. They just gotta be pretty big. Okay, Baron's offline. I think we just yeet this pile right here. Is keeping two diamonds greed? How many jacks are in the deck? One, two, three, four, five, six. Six jacks in the deck out of 30 cards. Not sp not fantabulous odds of pulling more. There is only one eight less than the deck, so the gods of getting a three of a kind here are not good. Either of these are odd. So I have quite a few diamonds, mostly all odd, a lot of them jacks. There's enough diamonds. I'm going to drop the two also, just a hard mull, because we, we, we do have to get to a playable hand. We have to hard mull... Like, I mean, this is optimization. We still need a fucking hand. The, we need a hand first. It's a pretty good time to dump the kings, really. Baron's off right now, but it will be on next round. Ugh. We could get like the thickest hand on planet Earth, but I think we just have too many kings. Mm. Do I just play them? I think we just play them. I think we do that. God, it sucks to throw out the three kings at the Baron buff, but we, we only, we get to play three more hands. We will have Baron for two of them. Five jacks in the deck, 25 cards. One in five cards is a jack. One king left in the deck. I think I can't greed diamonds right now. There's still a ton of them in the deck. I think we just four, uh, four card discard. Keep the kings, keep the jacks. Absolutely fucking penalized for our choice. Hard mole again, get a tarot card. Ev eviscerated for our choices. 1.5 mole while this card stays in hand. All right, fantastic. Let's just throw that on a fucking king. Okay, so the king barons itself. The king's double barons now. Now we're going to play a fucking terrible hand. It's very bad. We are fishing. One fear. There are five jacks in my deck of 17 cards. If I do not draw one of them, I think I have to play the kings. Whew. 
All right. This is the fat hand. It doesn't matter if I put the king in it or not. This is off. So it's better because it's 1.5 if it's either in my hand or on on the forward, on the board. What how much this hand is worth determines if we're gonna win. Because then we gotta then it's three of three of a kind kings. It's the next hand for sure. This hand needs to be like 30k or we're fucked. This is it. This fucker's gotta be like 30 grand. It should be pretty fucking big but we are losing smiley face so that's 12 molt we should have that we're not going to yeah. 33k i think we're fucking in there okay a little bit of fear inside me right now baron's off anyway so we're absolutely playing these It's three diamonds on the back. That has to work. That has to fucking work. I, I have literally no alternatives. The only thing I could do is play fucking odds for Todd, but that's not going to be better than the 1.5 multiplayer. Rehitting Baron, 100% the Kings are going back in. We can't score him anyway. We lose the steal. Ooh. This multiplayer is better than the plus four from Smiley, so fucking please. This should be fine. There's no, there's no fucking way this doesn't work, right? There's... There's no way this isn't 13k. It has to be. It's another 30k. It's another 30,000 hand. It's another 30,000 hand. The motherfucker can play some goddamn Bolitro! Woo! All right, yeah, this is a neat game. This seems cool. I like this game. That's our first run, so that's pretty good. <laughs> Seed tutorial. <laughs> that's kind of funny that the seed it uses is the word tutorial. All right, we did it. We beat the tutorial, everybody. We're in the fucking game. We're playing some motherfucking poker. I may not really know how to play poker, I may not know how to play Balatro, but I do know how to play me some roguelike deck builders. So, so, you know, some degree of that translates. So we can take this into endless mode, but I mean, this run is not long for this world. And I kind of want to go see all of the new shit that we unlocked. We played three of a kind 30 fucking times. <laughs> Woo! That's a pretty good first run, baby. That's a pretty good first run. Winning a first run in a roguelike, I think, is not a terribly common, like, roguelikes in general. I mean, I don't know for Balatro specifically. I don't know if it's, it doesn't seem like it was that hard. Though we did, yeah, we did absolutely just sit in the backpack of that immediate level four three of a kind and then just wrote it to the finish line we got direction immediately i mean i know how roguelikes work i know how deck builder works i know direction when i see it in a game like this especially where it's pure just deck building poker hand synergy i know direction when i fucking see it you don't look a gift horse in the damn mouth we got handed your three of a kinds or level four i think in Stop the first right there, shot immediately and i said okay that's what we're doing. Manchild, what the, what the fuck happened to your hat? 78 months in the pool? What the fuck's your hat? You were the shiniest squiddling. Can zone. High quality hats. Not that I've watched money, but I've not seen anyone win a run. Well, you just don't watch real gamers. I don't know. This is fucking real gamer hours out here, dude. Well, you think I can't win the tutorial run of Balatro? We, New Discoveries 79 is a hilarious number. Did this... <laughs> New Discovery 79. I did see a lot of stuff popping up that it was unlocked. So we should go look at all of the stuff that we unlocked before we start another one. I have to fucking pee, though. I'm going to stand up, run to the bathroom, take a break real quick. Don't go too far, everybody. We'll be right back. More power stuff. More cards. More poker. Look at, my, look at this cheese. No, cheesecake pr takes priority. He doesn't want to look. 
He's got stuff to do. He's a busy man, the captain. It's okay. It's okay. It was enough to explain anyway. I see my cheesecake. Nobody's excited about my cheesecake. I'm the only one that's happy about the cheesecake. I wish you could play this game as Zora Link from Majora's Mask. <laughs> I wish anyone cared about my cheesecake. If this if this is fucking rabid Rosalina, I'm turning this game off forever. <laughs> Her name is literally Edge. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's amazing. That is actually amazing. They've done a great job with this. No. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Her name yep. is yep. just Edge. Yep. yep. <laughs> I, I you know, you've sold. I've been sold on this character now. They knew what they were doing. <laughs> they knew. <laughs> Not a spark hunter. My name's Edge. Welcome to the Edge. Welcome to Edge. We have enough schematics between what, what's left over in mind to get a new piece, please. Yes! 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 We got the f axes! Yes! That's yes. literally the best possible roll. That is oh. that is the highest roll oh. we could possibly have gotten. That is that that makes oh. up for the five thousand pairs of pants we've gotten. That's literally the best thing we could have gotten. That's the that's my that, favorite. That weapon. and the mage necklace. Those are like the two. Oh god. Oh sorry. That was that was incredible. You good? Yeah. You no, got I'm it just, all, I, buddy. I I, I, I sl like clap my hands so hard my wrists hurt. <laughs> like a Mega. fucking Probably seal. Probably limp, but like... Like the quest line that, that adds this to the game is not added yet. Backwards daddy looks just as well. Sofa them. Sofa men. Sofa them is metaphors backwards. If you just use the PH as a single entity. Every day. Every day we stray further from God's light. <laughs> God fucking damn it, they caught me again. <laughs> They're gonna suffer them. GM, I speak cat. What are they saying? GM, GM, I took cat as a known language last level. I know what they're saying. What are they talking about? What are they saying, GM? GM, I can speak that language. What are they? I want to know what they're talking about. Tell me about their conversation. Do you really think you can understand us because you're wearing a cat speak amulet? Yes. You fucking moron. What do you want? Nothing. Fuck you. <laughs> I never have I been so destroyed. <laughs> like... That's it. I guess I'm retiring. That's it for me. GG. GG, honestly. Jagex wins. I'm out. <laughs> the problem is the guy in the back is now baiting half the Hellfire shots. Oh no, oh no. Ah! Ah! My face! Ah! Oh no! I don't think you can kill the reapers. <laughs> so picture this. Okay. You're in a dungeon. 
and you are been cornered by a skeleton. Spooky. Super spooky. And you've only got this dagger to defend yourself with. Mm -hmm. And you're trying to stab the skeleton, but it's not really a thing. Doesn't cut bone good. Goes right through the bones. He just calls you a jerk. There's nothing else that really happens there. So you decide, well, maybe I can try something else. Kind of knock him down. Trip him. You can trip him. You can do a trip attack. And then he's on the floor. Maybe you've an easier time getting at him. Your friends might be able to come and help kick him and try Tactical to Tactical advantage. Exactly. So you make this trip attack and you roll this d20. And you know, you could pass or you could fail. You could either successfully knock him down or not. Exactly. But let's say you roll like a 19 and you add Pretty your good. modifier to that. And that's high enough that you can trip the skeleton so hard. You Pinwheels in the air, smashes his face on the floor. Just explodes. Explodes into pieces. <laughs> Dead. Okay. Right? The other possibility, though, of course, the universal tragedy of role-playing games, the, the nat, nat one. one. Absolutely. You roll this nat one, and you try oh, to well. push this skeleton, and the skeleton just just pushes you right back. Just right on the... Buddy. To Bolitro. My first day playing this, we won our first run, which was our first run. <laughs> so, that's cool. I want to look at all the cool stuff that I unlocked. We could go in endless, but I don't, I don't think that deck would make it very long. Blue deck unlocked. Plus one hand every round. Joker unlocked. Joker, Tarot, Planet, and Spectral Cries may appear multiple times. We did see him. We already saw him. Okay, so when you unlock something, it immediately starts appearing in the run. It can appear in the same run where you unlocked it. That's cool. I wish more games were like that, honestly. I will admit, I don't really understand what this means. Uh, I get the jokers, so you can have duplicates of the same joker. That's interesting. But, like, you already can get a bunch of the same tarot and planet and spectral cards. I guess what that means is you can theoretically open up one of those big packs where you get to pick two, and it has two copies of the same card, like, in one pack. Or you could, like, bank two copies of it. I don't know. I have a gold card with a gold seal. I didn't want to do that, but it's okay. When round begins, add a random playing card with a random seal to your hand. Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, that's spooky. You just get random cards added to your deck. Ooh, <laughs> I don't know about that one, Chief. Doubles all listed probabilities. One in three goes to two in three. So 50-50 becomes 100%. I can't remember what it was. There was one card that was a one in two chance to do something. This would guarantee it. That's interesting. 50-50 is becoming guaranteed. It's the biggest fucking uptick for sure. Yellow deck unlocked. So the decks are all just... They must do something. They can't just be strictly better than the red deck. Start with an extra 10 bucks. Okay, Joker unlocked. Flower pot. Times three molt. If playing hand, if played hand has all four suits, I feel like no matter what you're doing, that's fairly hard to manifest. Times three molt seems like a rough payoff for something that's so difficult to do compared to just like hold two kings or play two cards of a specific suit instead of four. And 16 cards in your deck, okay. The driver's license. I love all the jokers. They come with so many stupid ass jokers. There are times to remember if you have at least 16 enhanced cards in your full deck. I mean, that being completely passive, is if it's on, it's pretty good. Green deck unlocked. At the end of each round, $2 per hand, $1 per discard, no interest. All right, that's just the spend everything deck. <laughs> Win or run. Okay. Copies the ability of the Joker to the right. Magic deck unlocked. Start with the Crystal Ball voucher and two copies of the Fool. Okay. Win a run in 18 or fewer rounds. I just skipped a bunch of shit. Okay. This Joker gets eight chips when a two is scored. Okay. There's a lot of ramping Jokers that you got to get early. Okay, bang it. Let me look at this. Wow, we didn't even... Whoa! Oh, it only picks the ones that you actually played. I was like, holy fuck, there's so... Okay, there's a lot of spectral cards. It only picks the planet cards that I actually played, but there's... 12 of these? There's not 12 kinds of hands. I think we've probably seen most, if not all, of the tarot cards. We just didn't play them all. They only count if you play them.
Oh, you can see unlock requirements. So that's cool. Yeah, we do not know what this does. Um, my prevailing theory, I don't know how it would work in this game, was some form of extra life or failure protection. Because I feel like that's weirdly common in roguelikes to give you the, I don't know, this item doesn't look like it's anything. And then it's death insurance. That's in a kind of strange number of games. Wait, so you can get negative anything? Any of the jokers can be negative? God. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. You have to... Oh, it gets into scientific notation? That is 47 billion. How do you keep exponentially gr I don't know how you'd even do that. I saw someone hit E40 yesterday. I don't know how you'd like, once you have, like up until you have a full set of jokers, I see how you can fucking basically exponentially grow. But once your Joker deck is full, I don't see how you'd keep scaling. I guess all your Jokers can just be negative and you can have 30 fucking Jokers, but like... God damn. Also, there's a lot of bosses. There's a lot of bosses. A lot of options. There's a lot of tags. We haven't taken that many. The varieties of booze. There's so many things. There's so many things. So. But Wiener, because it doesn't look like I'll be able to figure it out from the game. Are these different? It's, it's a yes or no question. I don't need specifics, but like, are these different? No, they are the same thing. They're just differently colored. It's interesting that they, yeah, they're different slots in here because they look like they're all ostensibly the same pack. It's pretty colors. Okay, fair enough. 13 out of fucking 150. Jesus, there's so many fucking jokers. There's so many jokers. What's the, oh, the chip is that I've won with it. Okay. So then you've also got like a secondary objective of winning the game with every Joker. Cause that little, I'm assuming that's what the little chip means is that I was in my final board when I, when I won. Ah. Mini locked Jokers. Mini locked Jokers. Whereas feelings from the roguelike has no content, so this is nice. Oh, there's stakes. We run. Small blind gives no reward money. Oh, so you're very encouraged to just skip it. You're very encouraged to just skip the small blind. So these other... Oh, red deck was giving us a passive. Red, red deck was giving us an extra discard. Blue deck gives you an extra hand. Yellow gives you 10 bucks. Okay, I see how these would be harder now. Is a hand not just strictly better? Oh, you can't raise the stake unless it's one that you already played. One consumable slot and two copies of the fool. I know there's a lot of, lot of decks. There's a lot of decks. There's a whole lot of decks out there. Okay, well, yellow deck seems like it's probably the best for like unlocking things because we'll have more money to buy jokers. Hello. Next base edition shop joker gives you plus 10 molt. Sold. <laughs> and we go to the big blind. My son. He has returned to us. The prodigal child. 
an echo of runs long past. Okay. There's pretty bad. Could get a little flushy boy in here. If I can get a clubus. If I can get a like a two parrot, I guess. Throw all these fellas in there, call it a day. Don't have any molt increasers or anything, but is what it is. Alright, the spare card doesn't do anything. I got very used to splashing. You know what's honestly probably the hardest part of this game? The first 50, like the first 10 seconds. Like <laughs> The very beginning is kind of rough. Ugh. Not like anything to go on. I have nothing to fucking score. I don't have a lot of spades in the deck, so I'll just toss those. Go for a club flush or a straight. I need a four or two clubs. Two clubs mission accomplished and leaves us a pair for later. Right, that's good. You just got to get like a good hand because your hand's base value is so much more important. You got to get like a good hand and you're in there. You got to get like a straight or a flush or something. You can't just pair your way to victory with 50 multiplier jokers. Okay. 21 bucks. Bean. Ooh. I would like this. That means I have to buy it right now. That's... If that pays out at max twice over the course of the run, it paid for itself. I would like the funny bean... Carry me for a couple of rounds, funny bean. I know I just said I want to get a bunch of money. It's going to be a minute. Turtle bean. There's so many cards. I have so many cards. My hand is enormous. The bean will carry us to victory. And then I'll sell him. We won. Thank you, Mr. Bean. Just one shot at a boss. Ah, by the power of Bean. What a good Bean he is. I really don't want to spend anything if I don't have to. Oh, God. That's huge! I would- my goal was to not spend any money because I need interest. But like, that's massive! I think I have to buy that. Fuck me, I didn't want to spend any money in this store. Initial cards and booster packs in next shop are free. Damn it. I'm gonna greed my way to an inferior league grave. That's a straight. Two, three, four, five, seven. I can count good. Like, <laughs> what is it called blind? I don't know. I'm not a poker player. Alternatively, we can 7, 8, 10, Jack, Queen is also a straight. <laughs> 
seven, eight, ten, Jack Queen. That's how cards go. We're doing it. Yeah, this is gonna benefit hugely from buffing the hell out of straights. Almost won immediately. All oh, right, Ace is also a one. Oh, that's a straight flush. Oh, hell yeah, brother. Get, get, get that fucker in there. I was just doing it for the regular flush, but it's also a straight flush. I forgot Ace was one or 11. That was almost double the pot value. Okay, so we got one more round of the bean being a positive. And then we still have the bean's holographic ability, so we got to... Okay, I really don't want to fucking buy anything. Oh, I want to buy everything. Right, everything's fucking free. That's pretty good. Um, all right. Stone card when blind is selected. 50 chips, no rank or suit. Yay. These two work together. Go desk cost energy. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. I'll take one of those. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Fuck it, spin the wheel. Did we win the one in four? We pulled the one in four? I don't know what I would, what the fuck is this? Ah, well, ooh, okay. Now the problem is I need I hold a straights of five cards, so I can hold it and it makes planets. Or you. This seems cool. I mean, a planet generator seems like it's good. That's a fun rock. We'll take a fun, we'll take a fun little rock. This is just a fun little rock. I gotta stop spending. Okay, can't spend any fucking money. Play only one type of hand this round. It's gonna be straight. Let's go. <laughs> I'll tell you right now, it's straight. The hand I'm gonna play, I pick straight. Seven, nine, ten, Jack, Queen. Almost a straight flush. So fucking close to a straight flush. Really fucking close to a straight flush. Merry Christmas. Here you go. So we can just do this and still really close to a straight flush. We can just do this and it's further from a straight flush, but it's got bigger numbers in it. We can just inch this fucker down. I mean, I could do a regular straight, but that's not as... I mean, this is actually just a regular straight now. We, we stopped skipping the eight number. This is just a normal ass straight. We're not cool anymore. We're just playing Balatro. It's an absolute inevitability. I'm going to hit discard instead of play hand at some point and just lose immediately. Thank you. <laughs> Next round, please. Like, <laughs> that's... Fucking annihilated. It's gotta be fucking crazy for me to spend rent money right now because I'm like really, really, really. I mean, why would I not play these? Oh, because I can get one dollar. Yeah, well, I mean, I can also just get variety in what hands are workable, so that's cool. Thank you, Weird Rock. I appreciate you. Really trying to get the interest ball rolling. And right now, I think we're currently powerful enough. Shop is an uncommon joker. Doubles your money. Oh. We're going to skip that one, so let's fight this. Let's see if we can one-tap this guy. Have a nice day. Bye. Thank you for, the, for your money. I appreciate you. Thank you for the dollars. Alright, we got enough of a lead. Okay, the bean's gotta go real fucking soon. Uh, the, the bean's gonna start committing extreme negatives against us. It's currently... The 10 multiplier is still worth it. It's down to plus one, so it's still positive. 
soon the bean must go. Okay, I can buy something if I really want it, but only if, like, I really want it. That's pretty good. This. Oh, it's a holographic. I was like, what the fuck happened? It's a holographic red card. Uh, this will pay for itself. Like, like 100% this will pay for itself. I want to get this, right? But it, the problem is it's not $10, it's $20. Functionally, everything in this shop is double priced because I'm about to double my money. Do we think I'll get $20 of value out of this? Probably not. Next round, please. Okay. Only one hand. Okay. A little rough. What I would say if I wasn't a fucking god of just playing straights. So, you know, I'm not, I'm not worried about it, really. But thank you. Have a nice day. <laughs> I mean! Oh, it kills itself. Okay. I'm beanless. All right, now we gotta start buying stuff on account of I'm being this. Woo! Money! All right, so we got some cash dollars now. Forty shows you remaining discard. Plus two multi hand contains two pair. Really? Now we're fucking doing? Read the room, please. Sure. I need. I just need some jokers. Looks like I get some fucking jokers on the board. I don't even know what I'd fucking do with tarot cards right now. I mean, they never hurt, right? Wait, they're gonna give me some power. What kind of power? I'm going for straight, so. The glass card. Times two mult 104. Oh, it just blows up. Okay. To make things the hearts so we can get straight flushes. Destroy. I don't really. Just the thing is, like, I don't really. Want to, like, get rid of cards? Straights are Welcome, weird, because. Squidling. Yeah, I want to keep the balance. Unless I can, like, remove... Gamba. Well, it's even, a it's even a cycle, because Ace... I mean, removing the like, twos and... You can't cycle. You can't do, like, fucking 9, 10, Ace, 2, 3. So removing, like, all of the twos and threes and shit could be useful, but I have to get them all before it stops be starts being helpful. Because if I have, like, a wacky number of them, it's not good. Adamok, 85 months in the pool. You with the shiny, you squiddling. Let's just poke their head in here. What's going on in the standard pack? We trigger this card one time. This is my ace in the hole. Okay, here's a I we I there's a problem. The face down is going to fuck me playing straights. Oh, face down is going to fuck my ass. That's going to be really bad. I don't need money, I need places to spend money. I'm okay on money. Thank you. Store, please. <laughs> okay. Create a planet card if your hand contains two or more eights. Um, so I can just start playing. This is good for... This is good for ramping. And this is a really good ramp. I don't have anything else going on right now. It's not like it's competing for space. There's no reason not to buy it. I mean, the reason not to buy it is because I can reroll it. I'm going big on hearts, I guess. I went to holding kings again. I mean, this went fucking great last game. I went to holding kings again. 
This is a fucking king holder. I got hands to blow. Not worried about it, really. Alrighty. That's not going to win immediately, so we might have an opportunity to uh, play a bonus thing. Because I played the king, so I wouldn't immediately win. I'd like to play some eights. Too many gaps in this. No, don't play card discard. Come on. Honestly, I can't skip to him. Four, five, six. Four, five, six, eight, nine. Okay. So we're safe right now. If we, if we get stuck, I can just play four, five, six, eight, nine. Looks like four, five, six, eight, nine is gonna hit the fucking field. Local man cannot draw a second eight to save his actual fucking life. I fished so hard. I fished so fucking hard. I could, I guess, I could have thrown someone with hands, but I want the money. I'm already down in interest because I spent slightly too much on the Baron man. This guy's actually not great in this because I'm going to want to play kings. So I don't really have a whole lot of say in what I play. Do have more face cards just card at the same time? At $5? Yeah. I do it once and pays for itself, I guess. But like, I don't have a slot. I'm definitely not one to throw shit in there. This egg. Yeah, egg is just money. Egg just becomes money. I actually don't know about this king man. This king man's not fantastic. I could grow an egg instead, but like we have a ton of cash. I'm not really worried about cash. It's good for an emergency cash infusion, I guess. I also have this. I don't really want to go to diamonds. Oh. oh, it doesn't. It just gives me another sun. Okay. Many suns. Yeah, Baron, we're not trying to use discards a little hard. He is. That's true. Yeah, Queen skips to Ace, which is nice. This. I don't feel. I'm going to roll five times for it just be worth it. That's hard. I don't really want to buy any of the rest of the stuff, so I'll just buy this because I stay at 50. 50 is my maximum. Uh, I don't I don't know about this one. This one, I don't feel like this is going super great. I think we're, we're I would say, struggling a little. Now it's a straight flush with two kings. Then we're gonna draw a bunch of crap and it's gonna fuck us. I fucking hate that that Aaron goes first. That's fine. Well, this is three of a kind. Okay. <laughs> At least. Uh, keep my king in case I need an emergency three of a kind play. Fucking zap him. Oh, would you look at that? Another straight flush. How unlikely. 
I can't believe I got another straight flush. That's fucking crazy. Wow, what are the odds? <laughs> I did count the face down king. Didn't it not do that last game? Am I crazy? I swear it didn't count the face down king last game. Oh, last time was an ace. That was wrong. Ah, I was wrong last time. I mean, that's the thing we're doing. You've never, I fucking give up on you. You failed me. You were given several chances. Hi. The deck's a little heart heavy right now. Uh, I have 22 of them. <laughs> Hearts. <laughs> Where is this motherfucker, by the way? Anyway. Plus one hand size is pretty good for straight simulator. Seems good. I need a lot of hand size space to do straight stuff. So, Baron does seem like it's tough. Banner is also me. Like it's, it's, it's there. It's not bad. It's honestly, it's pretty good. I'm gonna buy this Arcana pack. It gives me a fifty. Son. Fool is like sun. The emperor could be anything. It could even be sun. I'm gonna take fool because fool's definitely sun. More suns, please. Hearts, 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 hearts. You motherfucker. <laughs> you son of a bitch. That's okay. Straight and straight flash are two different hand types. So, you know, we'll figure it out. I fucking hate the eye, dude. The eye fucking sucks. Fuck the eye. Eye's a dickhead. I might want to keep this until the boss. Ooh. Actually, don't have anything. Three of a kind is actually really bad. Wow, three of a kind is terrible. Hmm. This is a little sucky. Um, you're a bit of an outlier. You're a little far away from the rest of my numericals. Should have probably played it. Ace, two, four, five, six. Yeah, okay. Oh, they're not multipliers, they're just flat. Okay. I should have just played it because I used the discard for banner. Oh well. I dunks the most built. Yeah, eyes eyes rough. Eyes a tough bitch. Eyes angry. Thank Queen King Ace. Fine. So look at that. Straight flush. What are the fucking odds? It's almost like my deck is 30% hearts or something. Probably fucking more than that. <laughs> it's a lot. It's a lot hearts. Oh, it's 22. I haven't used this yet. I'm saving that so I can do a straight flush and a regular straight. Thank you. Thank you. A little bit of cash, please. Two remaining hands and then my 10 interests. That thing is crazy fucking paid for itself. Yes, please. I'm unclear why you would ever not use these immediately. Like both of these, please. Yes, please. Keep leveling up the straight. Keep leveling up the straight. Make the straight strong. Only straightness. 
Soul? What the fuck is soul? Yeah, I can make a stone card. Creates a legendary joker? What's my shittiest joker? Why is it barren? I just don't think Baron centered like Baron is really good. I just don't think it synergizes with this build very well. Opinions? Opinions in the chat? I mean Lusty Joker is kinda weak too, but we are a very, very hard heavy deck right now. It can't be these two. These two are fucking nuts. I don't think you banned the Baron. Oh, he's horrifying. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, buddy! <laughs> like, that's pretty good! <laughs> Sorry, what was that you were gonna do to me? The eye? What were you gonna do? What were you gonna fucking do? I think I'll make more money. Let's see. Cards and booster packs next shop are free. I think I'll make more money by playing it than I will by doing that. Even if I bought like everything. Because I'd have to buy both jokers for it to be even close to worth it. To, to paying for itself. Their in crazy interest means we make so much money from fighting. Two, three, four, six, one. <laughs> counting. I can counting. Well, I guess I can just fire the fucking sun cannon then. I just literally it's just whatever with reckless abandon because the boss doesn't matter anymore. You know, this is kind of getting bad, actually. Because straight is better than straight flush right now. That said, at some point in the future... Theoretically, at some point in the future, we'll, you know, upgrade straight flush because I will obviously take that if given the option. I'll take upgrades on straight flush because our deck is fucking amazing in making them. That's true. I have Lusty Joker. The Lusty Joker probably makes up, makes up the difference. David, eight, nine, dick. As long as there's one wrong, if there's one incorrect card, it's not a straight flush anymore and we're, we're Gucci. I need, to, yeah, I need to find like one planet that upgrades straight flush and it'll probably be even because the upgrades gonna be massive, I imagine. Because the higher tier things get bigger upgrades. This dude's fucking running with his own dick right now. Lusty Joker's going crazy. Lusty Joker's popping the fuck off. Two hands. Yes, we made 16 bucks. I'm pretty sure we would not have spent 16 bucks in the shop. Each of every dollar. Ooh. That has phenomenal synergy with this run. Twenty-five hearts. That's got. That's just better than this. Also, it means I can use my discards again, so we get a little, we get some flexibility. That's just better. Hey, this guy's still here, believe it or not. Ah, Saturn! Hooray! The straights win again! This is so bad, it's almost... I'd almost rather have one dollar. <laughs> I would almost rather have a dollar than use this, but you know... We have plenty of money. In an emergency, perhaps, this one level we put into pair will save us. Well, no, I don't want to reroll, because I want as much money as physically fucking possible. Plus, I can only reroll for Jokers, and my Joker sounds pretty fucking good. Like, I don't know what I'd even replace these guys with. Boss disabled. <laughs> Off.
So in the weirdest fucking twist imaginable, I think we pretty much just like discard pairs because I just want as many different numbers as possible. There's so many different ranks that'll make this work. And I can use my discards freely now. You're kind of an outlier right now. Four, five, six, seven, eight. And if I use this five, it's stronger. Thank you, non-heart. The rare non-heart card making an appearance. This is literally just better to do this. It's very slightly better. Then I keep the four and the five for more straighting in the future. Be, be straight and do poker. We've moved on from be gay, do crime. Be straight, do poker. Son of a fucker. Oh, you get to hang out forever. Okay. Eight, nine, ten, jack. Eight, nine, ten, jack. Something. So throw you out. You're an outlier. You're probably not going off. I've already played a low straight. We're looking for highs and face cards right now. We're looking for six, seven, nine, queen, king. I played it. It happened. There it is. I hit the wrong button. It was still 1,500 points. Inevitability has come. I, I told you, like, there's a 100% chance I'm just going to hit the wrong fucking button and either play or discard the opposite of what I mean to do. I don't know if I should... Someone said you can swap these. I don't know if my brain has these, like, intuitively backwards. Because I'm right most of the time. I think I'm better off just getting used to it. Lusty Argonian maid going kind of fucking nuts up there. Planet. I mean, flushes are great for me too. I could absolutely fucking do flushes. My deck is 50% hearts. A fuck ton of money. Yes. Grow and become strong, my brothers. I think I have played almost exclusively straights. really hard to say no to two planets i don't really need the hermit i'm good on money it's really hard to say no to two planets oh yeah fucking pulling saturns oh fuck motherfucker ripping fucking saturns you ever see a motherfucker make a full uh full house out of only fucking hearts I'll open this. If there's nothing good in there, I'll just close it again. I'll just put them down. Wild Foil Queen is pretty fucking good. But that's a tarot card when discarding. Ooh! Or I could just take a five of diamonds. That's... It's got to be this, right? The tarot card generation's got to be more valuable than just a wild queen. Because I can also play this if I need to. For, it's also foil. I don't really give a shit what the suit is. Like, it's nice or whatever. But, like, I got to go for the fucking tarot fishing. Let me fucking roll this guy. Okay, so I can spend $3 to make $21. Don't mind if I do. Sure, I'll absolutely do that. I'm not using a lot of the same cards. The bean has returned to us. Ah, oh, damn it. This would have been really good early. The problem is the bean doesn't stick around. Odd Todd's back. He was holographic before. Now he's just a guy. All right, let's go. How right, what you got? 15 bucks? 20 bucks? 
I don't really need money. I'd rather have shops. I need to spend money. Tarot card, please. Honestly, you're not really... None of you are really what I'm going for. Sure. It's never bad to have backup plans. Get a couple backup plans. I'm not going to play any fucking four of a kinds, but who knows. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's a regular straight. Um... Which is still better than a straight flush, yeah, but the straight flush is also pretty strong. Get as many hearts, hearts out of my hand as possible, trigger a bunch of lusty jokers. Fucking slam that bitch. Good sell planet cards mid-run. Yeah, I get two chips. It's two chips for selling a planet card because they, they sell for one. My brother, the rock, has arrived. Oh, I almost one-shot him. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, fuck. And what I meant to say was two pair. <laughs> I meant to say two pair. My mistake. Surely that'll give me at least a thousand points, right? We're not like completely fucking relying on straights. We can play other things. We're pretty fucking relying on straights, but it did get us there. Planet. Well, two pairs got a little stronger. But he's only selling for once kind of hurty. That's why I'm like, I don't know. I don't get why you'd ever do anything other than just use them immediately. Because the cell value is just so low. That's true. Bowl is sort of carrying. Bowl and a holographic are kind of carrying. It's full house. I'll pay three bucks to level up full house. Fuck yeah, I will. I'll absolutely pay three bucks. To Our full house is getting kind of playable. It's level three now. Full house is getting kind of playable. It could be anything. It could even be nothing. It looks like it adds between like Stop 1 right and 25 scum. molt. It's good. Kilgore 5, 40 months in the pool. Canzone has sparred you without a fucking hat. You with a shiny a squiddling. Looks like it's between like... I, I, I've seen zero. I don't see any negatives. Is it insane that I honestly kind of am considering getting rid of this guy? Because like, I'm, the problem is if, it, if it's like debuffs hearts, I'm like, oh, well, fuck me. Like, this is insurance. Using a, using a whole slot for insurance, though. <sighs> this is too big because it's holographic. This is fucking mandatory for our run. So it'd be Lusty or Bull. Lusty or Bull are the only two I can spare. Great flush. Become stronger. Looking for Saturns and Neptunes. Saturns and Neptunes. Saturns and Neptunes. Level 7 straight. Oh, for three bucks. I'll buy it for three bucks. Fuck it. For three bucks, sure. Yeah, it's just worse bowl though. Give me one more reroll. What? Whoa! Whoa! Pause! Pause! Hold on! <laughs> Wait a second! That's fucking... Okay, so here's the thing. Both of these are really good. These are both incredible.
I think this replaces Lusty. And this replaces Bull. And we literally only play straights. I Well, straight fucking flushes, ideally, but, like, that's kind of hard. I gotta pick one. I mean, we can, we can actually, we can play both. This isn't just, like, this scales both. God, I think we get Lusty and we get Bull out. feels insane you guys have done so much for me bull's so strong right now but but this is too funny not to do this is one of those moments where like 100 percent, i think we just got weaker but holy fuck it's so funny <laughs> like it's... i'll absolutely get weaker for funny you fucking know me you know how i do video game i will a million percent make our deck worse for funny I don't need the pairs. You might have to go. What if the fire has to explode the next boss? Okay, we have a problem. I can't make anything. To be fair, the exchange of cards has not affected this. I can't make anything with fucking anything. Now I can make things. And Jack, Queen, King. That's a straight, apparently. That's basically, that's functionally a straight. Then he can be 50 chips. If I want to add Mr. 50 chips, man. Here's the emergency button. Let's break glass in case of emergency. Ten Jack, Queen, King. That's a flush, right? Or a straight. the fucking straightest thing I've ever seen. Three, four, five, seven. That's a straight flush, right? <laughs> That's a straight flush. I can't skip two. Damn it. I can't. Yeah, wh what? What? I can skip two? Oh my god, it's not. You can skip one. Oh, I misunderstood what Shortcut did. Oh, I totally misunderstood this card. You can skip one between every fucking card. I thought you could skip one in the straight. I didn't even... I look, I just looked at 235. It even gives you an example. I looked at 235 and I was like, oh, you can skip four. Cool. Okay. I get the concept. Did not even look at the back end and see that it also skipped six. Oh, Jesus. This is, that's way stronger than I thought it was. So the seven's even included. The seven's a part of the fucking straight. Oh, that's nutty. That's silly. That's fucking silly. Okay. We're gonna need to get a little stronger pretty quickly. Because the problem is, these are both just... Like, this is powerful. This is just enabling. We have two of our... Three of our five jokers are just quality of life. Only two of them are actually adding to our score. Which is these two. I... I think one of the convenience cards has to go. And I think it's probably Chico. I want to buy a Jumbo Arcana pack. Might make more hearts. Another stone card. Destroy two cards. Molt cards. Two planets. Let's just take two planets. Never hurts to get two planets. kind of level it we've we've had so many planets in this room we're leveling up the shit out of everything yeah, yeah I'm, I'm keeping i'm keeping him for this boss i'm not getting rid of him right now 
because this this boss is a little if the, if the boss after is weak i might drop him we got we only got two left and just bank on the final boss not being the worst thing in the fucking history of the world but look at this six bucks is a big fucking ask six bucks is a lot Can I, is it, can I look at the map? I can't look at the map right now, right? The problem's gonna be, we're gonna be really low on chips. Because these are both just molt enablers. 210 and 180 aren't bad. I really wanna drop Chico for fucking this thing. Because this is just gonna absolutely fucking. Oh, that's seven. Uh, it, oh, I misread it. I thought it was an ace or a straight. Okay, never mind. I thought this was just gonna pump like no one's ever pumped before. Now nah, we'll just keep going. Ace and a straight. I missed. Yeah, I misread that. I'll look in here. See if there's anything cool. You're discard for a tarot. You're also a molt doubler. Polychrome. 30 extra chips and a times 1.5. That seems like it's a good... Uh, it's also 7? Seven? 7's really good for a straight build. It's like right in the fucking middle of the line. So like it can enable both directions. I want to be a little weighted towards the center, I think. Hey, right, Chico, tell us how to fucking eat shit. Thanks, Chico. 6, 7, 8, 9. 4. Five cards straight. You can keep the four though, because the four and the six go together, apparently. So we'll just play. Well, give me more chips, but it's only a club, so I don't really care. Let's do this. Fire the fuck gun. We gotta get rid of one of our conveniences. We have too many conveniences. It's too convenient. Because yeah, we're not scoring very high. King, queen, ten, eight, six. We need a fat scaler. Honestly, I don't think we need four fingers, especially now that I know how shortcut works. Our full house is not bad, honestly. It's a little worse than the straight. Also, it's not going to trigger supernova. Yeah, four fingers is funny, but we don't need it. I think both of these can probably go. <laughs> this is stupid. Six, eight, nine, Jack. Yeah, that's a straight, obviously. What the fuck are you talking about? A four, that's also a straight. That's it, but that's just straight. Look how straight that is. Usually, look how fucking straight this shit is. See, I don't need this fucker. I can pretty much make anything into a five card. That was a lark and straight. My anus! Okay. Money, please. Thank you. God, we have to get rid of the convenience. Negative. No, that's a convenience! I can't take conveniences! It's free though, it's a negative, so I can actually. Yes, please, more planet cards in the shop. I can now spend four dollars without going down. The conveniences will go, but it's gonna be a little bit. 
time to roll some money. We don't, I rolled, I dropped one. We dropped one. You don't want to roll down until it's time to roll down. You don't get to come back from that. When you roll down, that money's gone. This is all future money as long as we keep this up. If we're not in danger of dying, I don't need to roll down. Oh, we haven't seen the next one yet. Who gives a shit about a diamond? What do I have? Nine of nine diamonds? I have two, three, four, five, seven, nine, ten king ace. That's all I fucking got. All the fucking wacky shits in the clubs and there's just a billion hearts. <laughs> like it's deep. I think it's time for Chico to go. There is one more boss, but I think it's time to sell Chico. Oh, we're, I'm looking to get rid of him. Skip, please. All right, what's the next one? What's the next? Okay. Oh man, I'm the straightest man that's ever fucking lived. <laughs> 300 times 22. 6,600 is the base value of a straight before anything else 6600 the absolute baseline value of a straight fuck me <laughs> okay well a plus 18 that's not even i'm not even fucking thinking about these though because there's 30 more malt right here Okay. I would like a store, please. Let us fight. Why does this look weird? Three, five, three, five, six, seven, nine. Let's get rid of the pair, actually. Take the ten instead. Five, six, seven, nine, ten. That's a straight. The chance. Yeah, I might actually want to unheart some cards. We may want to unheart some of the hearts. Our hearts may be too hearted. Fucking stupid. Oh, there's 27k. And Jack, Queen, King. <laughs> That's a straight. As far as I can tell. We do need to get some minute, but like, do you, you, I think both of these can go. I'm worried about regretting getting rid of four fingers because like four fingers does come in sometimes, but we're not using all our discards and shit. We're not using any of our fucking discards. Two, three, four, six, eight, straight flush. Sorry. Um, oh fuck. Sorry. You gotta go, Mr. Eight. I don't think you're, you gotta, yeah, Mr. Eight, you gotta go sit down. You can, you can wait. It's okay. I'd rather just play a regular straight. Thank you. <laughs> Two, three, four, six. I can't believe we're actually getting fucked on the straight flushes. <laughs> okay. Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. One dollar. I lost one on interest. We're definitely starting to fall behind a little bit. These are terrible. God, my money's kind of low. Fuck. We can take a banana until we find something else. I mean... It's just 15 molt. I mean, we're looking to get rid of stuff anyway, so like, it just blows itself up. Um, where are you? Well, that's sort of the opposite of what I want to do. You're both bad. <laughs> Fuck it. Damn it. First played face car. Face car gives times two molt when scored. Hmm. 
Let's look at the standard pack. If there's anything cool in here. Okay, this is the kind of stuff we need. We need stuff like this, like an enabler that I can just hold on to. It's also a seven. I can play it if I have to. We're kind of getting a little stacked on sevens right now. Um, it's an enabler. We need an enabler. Diamond cards debuffed. I don't really care. Um, that does immediately kill the thing I literally just bought, but it's still my shit still works. I don't, I don't fucking care. Hopefully the banana is enough to get us there. It's called Gross Michael. And Jack, Queen, King. Straight. What is this three? What is this? My previous deck? How do I have three fucking jacks off rip? I'm just fucking Jackopolix. Ten molt. Twelve molt. Twenty-two molt. Fifteen molt. 26k. Two, three, four, six, seven. I want to get a straight. Oh, right. I forgot. We really want to go for straight flushes. I for completely forgot about Seance. I mean, obviously we can't right now, but we, well, it could be a discarding, but I think on the boss, I kind of want to focus on winning. I, got, I forgot this is here. So I want to fight small blinds just to try to farm for Seance straight flushes. Should be pretty easy. All the shit that I have. Hey, get out. There's too many of you. We're high weighted right now. Nine, Jack, Queen, King, Ace. And that should be a dub. Should be a wiener. We want something better than the banana because the banana is going to fucking kill itself. And also, it's not that strong anyway. This thing's supernova's nuking pretty fucking hard. Banana safe. Sure, I'll level up three of a kind. Because it's not a, a game where one dollar is gonna make a difference to me. It's not a build where one dollar is gonna make a difference to me. Rather, it could very well be a game. I think we need that grabber. That one extra hand could absolutely be the fucking difference. The grabber is definitely the biggest fucking thing we can get right now. Keep me alive, please. I have fear in my heart. All the odds I get a Saturn. None, unfortunately. Well, if I have to play a full house, something has gone horribly fucking wrong, but it, or two pair rather, at least it's level five. Not good. That's okay. I mapped it out to have enough right here. 30 extra chips. All right, you know, there's an argument for all of these. So I could use the world to unheart three of these because straight flushes are bad now. We do not want straight flushes. I mean, they trigger seance, but I don't really care. I want regular straights. So I could world off the heart, these three hearts. Plus 30 chips on like a couple of eights, a couple mid rangey cards is pretty cool. Or we could get two tarot cards. They could be anything. They could even be the Hierophant of the world. <laughs> what do you think, chat? But gambling. The Emperor could also be the world. The Emperor could also be the world. Why, 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 why am I asking chat like chat doesn't want to fucking gamble? Those are the worst two tarot cards, I think. I don't really want to increase. Well, I could use this on two twos. Because if we can just cut off one into the scale, that could be useful. What the fuck happens if you strengthen ace? What the fuck? I need stores, please. I'm going to... I need to go to the store. It's very important 
that I go to the store. I think it's actually I just want to sell this. I think this is just strictly worse. I don't see a reason to play this. I can play it on some kings, maybe. It'd be okay on some kings. Three, four. Can I make some straight flushes, please? Shouldn't be that hard. Oh my god. Okay, give me this. Thank you. I'm going to keep this for flexibility because I might have to use it to survive. I can use it to make one big fucking hand. Oh, 10 and Jack. Dang it. Shit. Shit again. We have three hands, like we're fine, but. It's a little bit spooky. We're in a slightly spooky hole. Thank you, banana. Just using these as discards. There we go. I don't want to break that. Let's just do this. We've got a couple of cards that can save us. But this is, oh boy, we're, we're gonna fucking die. Banana survives another day so that I can sell him later. Ooh, I don't know. I don't know how the fuck we're gonna survive this. We're gonna need the fattest straights or it's ever seen. This has to go. We need huge enablers. Huge enablers. Straight flush is getting pretty big. This isn't the roll down phase yet. Roll down's after the next one. After the next one, we're gonna roll down hard. Hmm. Got both. They're close. Upgrading straight flush would make it similar to straight. They're like basically a level five straight flush is pretty much the same level as a level 10 straight. Straights are easier. I think we just need to go with ease of use. Next shop, we're rolling down to zero. We have to. We gotta fight this guy. We gotta roll down to the fucking void. Just figure out that fucking hell we're gonna get 300,000 chips. These two gotta go. They gotta be something big. They gotta be egregious. They gotta be fucking massive. And when shit works out, we can play some pretty decently big hands. That still isn't even fucking close to getting us there, though. That's one of our best possible hands, and it's not even close. Straight flush means you're not included. Even if that was a little bit better, we wouldn't have been close.
fuck am I supposed to do with this? This is the kill yourself card. This card literally just fucking ends your run immediately. It's $2. That's true. If we get it early, it could be super nice. I could see that. The straight flush can skip the card in the middle? It can skip the middle card? It can be a straight flush around the center? What the hell? <laughs> oh yeah, I got a flush and I got a straight. That's weird. That's a bit of a weird one, I will admit. A little strange. Four fingers works in mysterious ways. Imagine two big bananas, they both blow up. All right, time to spend literally all of our money on a fucking dream. The dream is some pair of incredible jokers and also a negative, maybe. We need some absolutely fucking phenomenal jokers. Nope. Nope. Absolutely unplayable. Odd Todd's not enough. Absolutely is not enough. I think we grab... I grab one of these and then I buy something better. It, they're both better than nothing. I think... What's our base chip? Our base chip is 300 and fucking 30. I think Smiley Face is better than Odd Todd. I don't know. I think the Molts more valuable. That's true. Also, we could we go. Let's hit the jumbo buffoon pack. Good, good. Let's look at this. Terrible, bad. Ugh. It's holographic, so it's at least plus ten mold. This multiplier is like sixty. Yeah, it's it's decent. It's just worse because it's holographic. Just 18 molt is pretty... That's literally just better than banana. That's a straight upgrade. Oh, man. I can't take enablers right now. I cannot take enablers. They're an argument for getting chips. Not like that, I don't think. Let's see, 160 chips is not bad. 160 chips, which will go down as we get closer to, to dying. It's, it would be replaced, well, it would have to replace Drunkard because it couldn't replace any of the rest of these. Like, well, this is 22 molt. This is 18 molt. This is 10 molt and a discard. This is fucking 27 molt. This is letting us continue being alive. This is a negative and not taking a slot. So it would be replacing Drunkard. I think what we got, what we got, fellas.
we got what we got i don't think we're getting a 300k that's such an insanely high number i it's fucking crazy that this doesn't give you extra hands all right we took we got rid of four fingers so it actually has to be a five card straight um a little high weighted right now if i strength this 10 i can ace queen jack 10 9 nothing i have cares about the suit or anything right no absolutely nothing cares about the suit or any of that anymore The suits are completely... The suits and the ranks are irrelevant. We're just playing fat straights and hoping the fucking numbers carry us. That's, that's literally all we have is just the numbers. Because the cards don't fucking do anything. It's just jokers running with each other's dicks. Some fucking days. Like, one half of what we need. It's not even fucking close. Jesus Christ. We're not even in the fucking ballpark. We're not even in the same state as what we need. We need to get a we need to get all our fucking modifier cards out. We got to get We got to stack our fa we got to get the steel card in our hand. We need to draw the steel. Yeah, that's good. Ton of sevens, though. We're getting absolutely fucking clowned on right now. Uh, okay. This is the yoke. <laughs> These draws are an actual fucking joke. These draws are a meme. They are a fucking meme. The draws are a complete and absolute show of buffoonery. Unfucking believable. There, I can draw so many cards and make a hand. We got fucked. That'll be. Fucking best we got, really. We gotta, we gotta start throwing them. So I'll take this kind of shitty straight. This will. I uh, couldn't draw the steel either. We didn't get the steel out. We're through. We were through half the deck, and we didn't get the steel card, which is unfortunate. This is fucking crazy. I mean, these draws are inconceivably shit. Don't get me wrong, but like this is, is impossible. This is completely fucking insane. I'm going to sit on this ace and hope we can combo with the steel. That's all I can do. We got to draw that fucking steel. It's probably too late. We need to draw the steel like three hands ago. This thing is giving us 30 mold and we're not even close. We're not even sort of close. That's a straight. Two, three, five, seven, ace. That's a fucking straight. It's great. It's blowing my mind how fucking far away we are. We're, we're going to maybe get to half. Maybe. Yeah, we got a couple of multipliers. Now it's way too little too fucking late. We needed this guy an hour ago. Still not enough. This is fucking no chance, man. <laughs> no chance. We need like two more hands. Damn it. And the only straight I can make involves playing the seven. 
because I have to do this. And then we lose the fucking 1.5 multiplier. I have to play the seven. Oh, man. Damn it. This is a fucking insane boss. 300 k is fucking nuts. We needed... We needed like three more hands. Because we, we're getting like... 30 to 40k a hand. We need... We wouldn't have even got, have gotten two. It would have taken... I think at least three more hands to get there. Holy fuck. Defeat a boss blind in one hand without using any discards. Eight dollars of played hand triggers the boss blind ability. Okay. Extra joker. One less hand. And we just got this guy from the soul card who, you know, would have single-handedly won the game. Apparently, final bosses are absolutely insane. Well, they're 50 50 of being insane because the previous final boss really was not actually bad at all. This dude was kind of whatever. Like, it's, it's insane that those are on the same tier. This isn't even one half the difficulty of 300k guy. This one's... I, I mean, I guess this one would fuck you if you were really heavily relying on one joker. If you, like, totally crutched on one joker and it kept getting shut off. But that's not even fucking close. The 300k guy. Which is why I wasn't worried about it, because the previous final boss was such doo-doo ass. It was so... It was so... Easy. It wasn't even... I didn't even think he was as bad as some of the regular bosses. Oh, we're unlocking... It's clearly a second version of every voucher. Oh man. I wish I would have known that was a thing. So these all have like an increased version. They all like upgrade. That's interesting. We got to know that's a target to aim for. Oh. Blank might X. Now that I realize these are in fact pairs, like they are clearly displayed as, blank might actually do nothing. Blank might just straight up do nothing and you just have to buy it 10 times. And once you've bought it 10 times, you get what it actually does. It might have to digivolve. It might have to fucking digivolve. Okay. Well, this is in fact super neat. I see why everyone's nutting about Balatro. This game is pretty fucking good. It's, it's, this is a fun one. They did a fantastic job. The roguelikes are an absolute dime a dozen. There's 10 batrillion of them out there in the world. And honestly, kind of hard to make one that like is really good and stands out. This, this kind of feels like one of them. Pretty fucking good game. If I stream tomorrow, I'm going to stream more of it. The question is, if I stream tomorrow, because if you didn't hear it earlier today, season three of Strange Aeons, the third chapter over on twitch.tv slash UGT show. Banjo-Kazooie, can you fucking, I'm trying to sell a horror campaign right now. Can you take Shitter Gulch Mine somewhere else? Thank you. This Saturday, three days from now, Strange Eons is back, baby. 3 p.m. Eastern, noon Pacific, twitch.tv slash UGT show, that channel right there, for the premiere of the next leg of our adventure. The party's level eight. We still don't know who the fuck we are. But we burned everything we know about who we are to the fucking ground. Made new friends, killed them. It was a great time. And uh, as the incredibly 
high panic stressor that I am, um, I have a great fear that I'm not ready and that I need to prepare. I need to do big, big fucking prep. I might take tomorrow to prep because I would rather do that than Friday because Friday I want to fucking play Dragon's Dogma. Real bad. So we'll see how I'm feeling tomorrow. I want to make sure everything's sorted. Balatro fucks, though. This game's real good. Thanks for hanging out, everyone. Thanks for being here. Appreciate your support. Hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. But if not, dogma. Goodbye.